I'm Shovel and welcome to my channel. Today we're starting a game called Little Witch in the Woods and we're gonna go see what it's about because I don't really know. I think we're a little witch in the woods and we have to make potions. So let's go check out the game and don't forget to subscribe. So we're gonna get started playing a new game. This is Little Witch in the Woods. How do I? Oh, select is Z. All right, <gasps> let's start. Toot toot! <laughs> oh, that's the little witch, I think. <laughs> I think that's her. I think it's her. That's the girl in the name of the game. Okay, my face cam's in the perfect spot. This is great. I wonder where the carrot was. What carrot? You were still thinking about that? <gasps> my hat talks! That's sick! If you end up not being able to see those, it looks like it'll be fine, though. I don't want to move the camera, but I might remove the subs, maybe, instead. Since they're a little in the way. Just keep subbing. <laughs> just do me a favor. Just do me a solid and just keep subbing, even though you can't see it. Uh, Fairies, thank you for subscribing. Plored, thank you for subscribing. And the 200 bits. And Disappointment, thank you for subscribing. Okay. We found everything except the carrot. I think it's good that we never found the carrot. What's the carrot? Who's the carrot is this? There was something off about that. Legendary carrot soup recipe. Are we gonna be cooking? I don't know what any of this game is. So this is exciting a little bit. I just realized we never checked the men's restroom. Yes, there are just some lines you don't cross. We searched the whole school, save for that place, but we never found the carrot. That means the carrot was in the men's restroom. A carrot in the men's restroom? What an odd sense of humor. I should write Jenny a letter asking her to look through the men's restroom. Can't you ask Will instead? It's the men's restroom after all. I don't know what's happening. Jixapero, thank you for subscribing. And Bleeding Rainbow, thank you for the 107 bits. Nope, that coward finds it. He'll take it to the teacher bawling like before. Keep in mind that if it weren't for Will, you'd be in jail right now. Girl, what did we do? Why would we be in jail right now? Or six feet under. Oh, okay, or dead, I guess. <laughs> what have we been up to? Um, Darth Knight, thank you for subscribing. Oh, I'm so bored. It's a flashback. Flashbacks are supposed to be boring. Oh, this is a flashback! Cute, I like it, it's clever. I see why no one else wants to ride this god-awful train. It's boring enough to drive anyone insane. Hey, a ticket for this train costs 500 pies. Pies are money? Okay, I like it. I'm liking this world so far. And it's stop the witch's house in High Lion, where all roads lead to. Your second place at the school for witches. Whatever, I don't care about any of that. How am I second place anyway? I even sneaked into the forbidden room twice. Are we Harry Potter? Three times. I even looked through the forbidden books in the hidden library in the school basement where Harry Potter. I still remember that horned rabbit that was as big as a house. No wonder Will started crying. So did I mess it? So did I manage second place? How did I manage? I can't read. <laughs> How did I manage second place? Oops. I simply didn't want to lose. Cut it out and sit quietly. This is a train only for those who want to succeed. Where are we even going? Oh wait, they just said where we're going. I just wasn't paying attention. The witch's house might be dark and damp, but it's only three years of your life. Fine, fine. Enough with the lecture. As a matter of fact, I'm disturbed with the thought of taking off my shoes when I get off the train. I'm so confused. Shoes for what? I wonder what kind of trouble you'll get into when we arrive. We're troublemakers. I like that. I like her. I won't. I won't fool around the moment I get there. I won't fool around the moment I get there. I didn't know you had self-awareness. Don't you know about the terrible city of rules that is High Lion? Will any of this ever make sense? Will I ever know what the carrot was? The first thing to do is take your shoes off as... The first thing to do is to take your shoes off as soon as you get off the train. This is my first time hearing something like that. I heard that Jenny's older sister... Oh, I can skip. Oh, thank God. I was like, I'm having to wait for the subtitles. I heard that Jenny's older sister was wearing strappy boots when she first arrived at High Lion. So she almost couldn't get off because she had to unstrap them completely. See, Mom bought me 
Mom bought me new shoes as well. H, thank you for the raid! Welcome, dudes. We just started a new game, and honestly, any, any of the dialogue that's already happened, you don't even really need it. This is literally the opening scene. We're going to a fancy new uh, witch school or something. <laughs> that we're about to spend our next three years in this school. Uh, I already forgot the name of the school. High Lion. That's all we know so far. And apparently at my old school, there was some prank of a, a carrot being in the men's room or something. I'm really not sure. Someone hit a carrot in the men's room. That's all I've gathered so far. Welcome, everybody. Thanks for joining. This game is called Little... Wait, what is it called? Little Witch in the Woods. Little Witch in the Woods. This is the little witch. This is her hat. He talks. Um... Mom bought me new shoes as well, because apparently there's like a thing about when you arrive, you have to take your shoes off right after you get off the train. Also, my cat is here behind me, loafing. You cannot see her, but she is just simply sleeping. She'll probably be there when we end the stream and I'll show you her. <laughs> okay, and the hat talks. Didn't Aria just mean to encourage you? No, dad also did say that comfortable boots would be better. That's strange. It's true. I'll also ask other people if you don't believe me. We keyword gained. This is the first time we've seen this. Lace-up boots. It's a pain to wear lace-up boots if you're boarding the train to High Lion because you have to take your shoes off. It's like the airport, I guess. <laughs> you have to take your shoes off. The truth, main. The truth remains one. Oh, I get, woo! <gasps> I clicked a button. <laughs> squishy. What are these? <laughs> Ooh, what's a squishy chub? And no jokes about it because this is a family-friendly stream. Pumpkin terrier? That's a dog. That's definitely a dog. Um, blue moon butterfly? Bush bug? Sprout bird? Blue bubble lizard? Pom pom? One eye frog? Tinkle spider? No one's allowed to make any uh, make fun of any of these names. You're not allowed. Um, okay. These are plants, which flowers. So we haven't discovered any of these things. Weed Terminator Potion. A potion commonly used for gardening. I have a feeling gardening might end up becoming involved. Also, they were talking about pies. And apparently pies are money, potentially. I'm not really sure. Okay, so we know how to make this potion. We just need squishy chub fur extract and witch flower extract. Who named... Why? And we don't know how to make any of these. There's a lot of them. And then last, curse lifting candy. A candy that can relieve a light curse, such as a curse that makes you forget to brush your teeth or a curse that makes you fall often. The sweet mint flavor of this candy is delicious. And that's also squishy chub for extract and maple herb extract. And that's, oops, all we know. There's only three candies. Oh. You can make the animals? Is that what that means? I'm really confused. You need witch flower extract, which is two witch flowers. Maybe? I am so confused. Okay. We're going to figure it out right now. Oops. We can investigate this. The food was really delicious, though. You face <laughs> was bright only when you were eating after getting on the train. Okay. I have nothing. I have no idea about this game. I just wanted to try it out because it looked cute. The omelet that was over. Oh, wait. What? The omelet that was overflowing with cheese and crab meat as soon as it was cut. The pink salmon steak seasoned with fresh lemon scented kiwi sauce. Even the slightly frozen strawberries and peach sorbet with whipped cream. Without this meal, I would have jumped off the train sooner. It's definitely different from the food you buy at the store at the school for witches. I ate that to collect the Great Witch series cards. I got scolded because I was caught keeping the card and throwing away the bread. Don't do that again in High Lion. I'll definitely try the Nabicula cupcakes. That's if I get to High Lion before I get bored to death. Okay, so we're just kind of like chilling on the train. I love this little character, though. This is fun. Let's talk to the bartender. Hello, Mr. Bartender. Hey, want a drink? No, I don't drink alcohol. Do you have any tea? Of course. 
Then I'll have a cup of that. The tea has alcohol, though. Is that okay? Do I have to remove the family friendly tag? I thought this was a wholesome... I mean, so far we're fine. So far we're fine. But then that's just alcohol. Alcohol with tea. Potato, potato. Then can I ask you a question instead of a drink? Anytime. Ooh. Now, if it was coffee and alcohol, I could see that. You can initiate conversations using the keywords at your disposal. Use keywords with Z. Change category with left and right, I think is what it's showing me. <gasps> Want some water? Personal stories, chit chat, shop. Lace up boots I can talk about because that's a keyword. Let's try. Can I take a look at your shoes? My shoes? What for? From what I've heard, you have to take your shoes off before you step foot into High Lion Station. You work at the train, so... You work at the train, so you know what I'm talking about, right? Oh, that story. Absolutely. Plenty of confused passengers who were all dressed up for High Lion. If you're wearing shoes of that sort, I'd advise you to untie them in advance. O ye who reacheth High Lion, look first upon thy shoes, or so that's how the saying goes. See, Virgil? His name is Virgil, the hat! The hat is Virgil. I was right. The preppy boots mom gave me... As a present, please <laughs> tell me just as much. Those are some nice boots, right? My mom bought them for me when she found out I was graduating magna cum laude, which is like really high. Uh, it sure is amazing you're graduating, <laughs> despite your antics. You're gonna keep up with that attitude of yours? Haha, <laughs> hearing the two of you speak, I have a feeling boredom won't be an issue. Nope, it's so boring. Aren't you bored, Mr. Bartender? I've gotten used to it. But it's certainly gotten less boring, thanks to you and your hat. You've been listening? Other guests would have heard about your arson at the School for Witches by now. Arson? Our girl is guilty of arson? Now, this, this is my kind of game. I didn't set it on fire. Really? Uh, sure, there was a fire, but that was because I shook a potion five times and made it explode. <laughs> Where's the arson emote? <laughs> Potions must be shaken three times only. Even a non-witch like me knows that. Exactly. How can you not try shaking it four times, having heard that? But you said you shook it five times. Nothing happened on the fourth time, so I shook it once more. An inquisitive mind. You've already got the makings of a fine witch. Thanks for the praise. I don't think he was praising you. I should be on my way, then. All right, have a fun trip. You can't act like a country bumpkin once you're in the city, got it? You're not going to ask just one person, are you? Why? One is never enough, you know. Even the greatest detectives never reach a conclusion based on the single, a single piece of evidence. You have a point. You can view your notes to see keywords you have. Okay, so our keywords are just lace-up boots. Hmm. Okay. I don't understand, but this is fine. How do I go back? Okay. Um. But also, I want some personal stories. What sort of work do you do here? I'm mixing my life and changing the alcohol. Wait, I think it's the other way around. I'm just an average bartender working in the most expensive place in the world. What brings you to this very expensive train? I thought you were listening to our conversation. I stopped listening when it got boring. <laughs> I'm going to be an apprentice at the witch, witch's house in High Lion. After working as an apprentice for three years, I will be able to graduate from the school for witches. Wow, High Lion, huh? That's the right proper place, isn't it? So they say. That's probably why you got the train ticket for free. You must be someone special. I don't really care about that kind of thing, though. That kind of thing is what's important at the end of the day. It's best to just suck it up. You'll be glad you did later down the road, you know. Yeah, later. Something on your mind? Chit chat. Let me know if you need anything to drink. Want some water? Oh, that's chit chat. Shop? We only sell alcohol at the moment. Something on your mind? No, oh, no, I guess not. Um, done. Goodbye. What else can I touch? Okay, we're gonna go this way. Oh, other people to bother. Actually, I remember seeing this guy in the little notebook, so I wanna talk to him. Train crew. Oh my goodness, he's precious. Oh my goodness, he's so precious. 
Up ahead is the engine room. Um, let's do chit chat first. Small talk is forbidden during operation. Oh, okay. Shop? Please save any inquiries regarding souvenirs at the station until after we exit the train. I'm an attendant of Brightman Railroads. My job is to ensure the passengers' comfort and safety. Up ahead is the engine room. Okay, so... Oh, there's a training activity. I didn't see that before. But we're going to talk about the lace-up boots now. <gasps> oh, man! Yeah. <laughs> you can't see him! Wait. Oh, that is really a shame, too, because... Look at this man! Look at that man! Let's talk about lace-up boots. Look at him! Oh, I'm glad I looked at the chat. I didn't realize I was covering him. Rosita, thank you for subscribing. Fear the Frizz, thanks for the prime. Good girl star. We don't check the passenger's outfit. Even if you don't check, it's inconvenient to get off if you wear strappy boots. There are so many different types of clothing that cause discomfort. I can't define them all. Them all. Then what about having a hard time taking your shoes off when you get off? Delays occur once in a while due to their shoes, but again, it's not regulated. I guess there's no fine. Isn't it a matter of harming social reputation rather than the fine? Is that so? Up ahead is the engine room. Okay, that's all he has to say, I guess. Alright, he doesn't really say much. Let's talk to him. Ordinary passenger. Hello! Whoa. Uh-oh. <laughs> Uh-oh, wait. Oh, hello. Am I disturbing you? Negative. What's the issue? This man's name is Roy. Oh, I want to ask you about something. You're on the way to High Lion, right? Correct? Um, what's the matter? Oh, it's just that you have a very blunt way of speaking. Oh my, old habits die hard, especially when one is deep in thought. You sound like the janitor from my school. Well, I used to be a soldier. So what brings you here? Stop talking about him being fine. <laughs> I knew, that's why I said, uh-oh. Speak. Uh, okay, well, chit-chat? I'm gonna start with chit-chat shop, and then personal stories, and then the item, because that seems like we're going from smallest to biggest pieces of dialogue. Since I'm not much of a talker, I don't have anything to say in particular. See, it, it gets that one knocked out of the way. I do run a flower shop, but as you can see, I'm just a normal passenger at the moment. I just wanted to ask. I don't know. I can't see. You live in Highline? Correct. I own a flower shop there. He would. Look at his little flower on his thing. Whoa. Speak! Okay. Lace up boots. Before that, what? You've been staring at my feet for a while. Is there some kind of problem? Oh, I was going to ask anyway. Isn't it uncomfortable to wear such strappy boots? It takes some time to put them on and take them off, but I'm used to it. Then it would be hard for you to, when you arrive at High Lion. What? What are you talking about? I mean, you have to take your shoes off when you get off. What? 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 Huh? Oh, you weren't kidding. Oh, you were kidding? Oh, you were kidding. I'm sorry, I'm rather dull when it comes to things like this. Jenny! Mr. Bartender! The mystery has been solved. Did I make some kind of mistake? No, no, I just realized that I was deceived. I had a feeling she was getting joked on, getting pranked. Yeah. Come to think of it, I remember now. It's a joke to make fun of people who visit High Lion for the first time. <laughs> Stop, you don't have to kill me twice by giving that much detail. I'm sorry. Are you holding back laughter? No, I'm not. He's trying so hard to be considerate of you. Don't ask twice. Virgil, I hate you even more now. You don't need to be too upset. When I went there for the first time in the past, I was also tricked by a colleague and took them off. Wouldn't he have remembered that when we asked about the shoes then? That doesn't comfort me at all. I'm sorry. How do you feel? Why are you asking me that? Your molars might fall out. Relax a bit and tell me. I can't believe Jenny deceived me. There's a reason why she's your friend. Now go back to your seat quietly and wait until we arrive. We still have three more days to go. Three more days. That's as terrible as the smell of spotted shiitake mushrooms. Well, I most certainly am not ready to go back. I want to look at things. Actually, I don't think there is anything else to look at. And there's no one to talk to. All right, I guess we're going to go back to our seat. We got three more days. All right, now have some patience and stay seated. Ugh. Done? Done, I guess? 
<laughs> what is happening in the chat? <laughs> Y'all need to be calm. I'm bored. But you just sat down. This is torture. Stare out the window if you're so bored. Yeah, look outside. Look at that mountain. Okay, that would be really nice to look at, though. I wouldn't mind a long train ride like this. The longest I ever did on a train was 21 hours. Uh... I didn't get to do a sleeping car or anything like that. That might have made it with the time a little bit better, but because it was kind of miserable. <laughs> they must be hiding a cave with strange pillars, statues, and a giant door. Sounds like the prologue to a story where you awaken a terrible demon. Wait, hold on. Virgil, shut up and look out the window at the summit of the mountain. There's a gigantic shining tree at the top. A gigantic shining tree! Why is it shining? Does it have luminous flowers? It must be beautiful up close. Give it up, this train won't stop for two days. Ugh, I wanna get out now. I hope it crash. Fat chance of that happening, so just stay bored. I also have a sore throat today, which kinda sucks, but I just tested negative for COVID yesterday, so I'm, I think I'm just, uh, got a little travel sore throat. After all, you signed up for three years of m even more boredom. Aren't there any... I'm sorry, what? What's a crocophant? <laughs> Crocophants nearby? What is that? What about boa constrictors? This isn't a jungle. Train robbers? This isn't the Wild West. It's a healing game, remember? This is a healing game? A crocodile elephant? Is that what it is? Hey, a boa constrictor. The correct line is, what's going on? Oh, the train stopped. There's no station here. Why are we stopping? I'm not sure. Maybe there's something wrong with the train. I doubt it's a boa constrictor, though. I don't care if it's not a boa constrictor. Please just say there's something massively critical. There's some massively critical issue. Please, please. Please. <gasps> Rooney Bear, thank you for subscribing. Oh, oh, it's the little guy. We apologize for the inconvenience. A critical issue, perhaps? The train cannot continue its journey due to a critical issue. Yes. Attention, the train will stop until tomorrow morning and the departure time, can we go outside? Will likely be announced tomorrow. We will depart immediately if possible. Okay, I'll be back in a bit. In the meantime, please avoid wandering off too far from the train. Let's go. I'm not sure if you remember, but of course I remember the shining trees at the peak. No, not that. We have to get back by tomorrow morning. Then we should get going. We're going to the tree. Let's ask this guy some things first before we leave. Welcome. What's up? Oh. Were you working at a bartender and not at a shop? I used to own a bar. Is this in this area? Sure did, my wife and I, the two of us. Well, you're both bartenders. I met her at work, after all. We had to move due to circumstances, though, so we are here now. I hope a time comes when you two open up a shop again. Something on, oh, well, I guess that's it. Oh, do you know why the train stopped all of a sudden? I didn't know if it would have the same dialogue or not. I've been here with you the whole time. I know as much as you. Does the train stop often? No, never. Time is money. If there's no good reason, it never stops. When they fix the problem, I'm sure we'll take off right away. The crew member just said we'll be leaving tomorrow morning. Oh, then I guess we're leaving tomorrow morning. He also said that we might leave as soon as possible, which... Which makes me think we shouldn't leave the train, but I'm pretty sure we're going to leave the train. Okay. Personal stories? <gasps> I may not look the part, but I used to be quite the big deal back in the day. Anyone ask? <gasps> Virgil, shut up. You must have been very popular. I literally asked. There were customers who'd visit the bar just to see me. Even to this day, I still take pride in these eyebrows of mine. They're good. They're good eyebrows. After all, even my wife said she fell in love with them. Whoa. A romantic tale that starts with eyebrows. Uh, okay, I think we're done here. Goodbye. There's the train, uh, the stairs off. Oh, I can't go this way anymore. Bummer. Okay, let's go. <gasps> Whoa, it's so dark. If you're scared, we can go back to the train. I love it. Let's hurry. Tab to open menu. Memo. Search for the shining tree seen from the train. Got it. Oh, that was the wrong button. That's my inventory, I guess I just accidentally found. These are my notes. I don't have any active keywords anymore. Look at the hat glow, though. Oh, wrong button. Sorry, you can't go beyond here. Why did the train stop? There is something in the train's path. We're working on getting rid of whatever's in the way. Something's in our way. Is it a boa constrictor? 
A boa constrictor? No, no, it's a strange prickly vine. A strange prickly vine? Yes, a prickly vine. It wasn't there yesterday, but it seems to have grown overnight. We can't seem to cut it down with the regular axe, but we're doing our best. We've contacted the witches, so I'm sure they'll be here to help in no time. Can I take a look? I happen to be a witch. You're our passenger. It's our responsibility to make sure you're safe. He's perfect. <laughs> we'll take care of it, so please be patient. Can I just take a peek? I'm sorry. Oh, he ended the conversation. There's not even, like, small talk. How long will this take? If we can take care of it on our own, it shouldn't take long. But it might take some time if it is a problem that we can't solve. Okay, that means... That means we really shouldn't be leaving. Oh. Oh. But, like, we're, you, you know we're going to be leaving anyway. It's a hill. It won't be easy to climb. Look over there. There are vines hanging on the hill. I'll be able to climb that much. That's bad news. Okay, so we can crawl up to here. Oh. It's a secret passageway, Virgil! I don't think it's a secret or a passageway. I bet there's a path beyond there. Oh, it's dark, though. Ooh, spooky. Ooh, spooky. Yep, that's not, that hasn't changed. Just checking. Oh. <gasps> What's this? Looks like a little honey pumpkin. What's that? It's a type of seed that grows in forested areas. The vines grow so fast that you can never get rid of them by hand. Oh. That sounds like our problem, pot potentially. You must find the nucleus hidden somewhere to get rid of it. Then I guess... We can also get rid of this if we find the nucleus. Or just return to the train quietly. That can't happen. Let's go look for the nucleus. It must be nearby. Since the nucleus gives off light, when you touch the vine, you'll be able to find it. Oh. Oh. You can temporarily get rid of the vines with the weed terminator potion, but they'll grow back after a while. Then what do I do? Find the core. It should be somewhere near the vines. Haha, -ha, it lit up over here. Got him. And there they go! Great, it's time to explore. Please don't use that word explore. That word gives me anxiety. No thanks to your mother. Sprint! Oh. Let's go left first. <gasps> oh, I can't get in. Go away. Get out of my way. I want the key. Okay, we can't go that way. Witch flower. How do I... What is, um... There it is. Okay. So... Oh, we can make these candies now, we know. Was there a potion? Oh, I can only make... The sunlight potion, I guess. Okay, that's fine. Now I can make soft candy, cough candy, and there's other candies. Okay, so I don't really know, but I'm just gonna take things as I find them. Oh, oh. That's no weed. What was that? It left something behind. A rittering? That's a cute name. Why was it buried here? Someone could have buried it, or it could have been sleeping. You're going to have to be more specific than that. Is this too loud or not? That's not... Uh, there's not much that's known about Ritterings. Well, other than good fortune if you find one. Yeah, I guess it did leave behind a gift of sorts. Try to spot them while you're wandering around. I didn't even see it. I just saw the thing pop up. Okay, I'll look for more. A black acorn with white stripes. A thin red leaf in the shape of a ribbon rests atop. It is used as a rare ingredient. 
Oh, I see. I don't really want to do that. Okay. Can I go this way? I'm just rummaging. <gasps> I like you. How do I get the arrow to come back or did I just kill it? So what's this? A hole? Branch. Okay, I'm just picking stuff up at this point. Can I go this way? This seems like a little... Oh, no, I can't. Maybe? No. <laughs> I'm trying to go off the grid. Get out. I'm stuck. Another witch flower. Oh, I can't go that way either. I'm just cran apple. I'm stealing as much ingredients as I can find. A mountain! That's a bad thing, right? I always hated mountains. My leather gets worn out from all the wind. Aww. See, when that pops up, I don't know what to... Oh, that's for healing me. I can't really do anything. I think I need like an item, but that's okay. I don't have one. See, I can do something with these ones. Dangle Mango! I can't get that one. Am I, is my inventory full? No, okay. There we go. I can't do anything with them. That's okay. Let's go run this way. Can't do anything with this either. I think maybe we'll get tools eventually. Piece of rock. Now my inventory almost is full, but I don't think I can make anything still. Um... Sunlight potion, Lunar's oil. Yeah, we can't do any of that. We can't make any of these. Okay. I'm just gonna keep grabbing stuff. Can't go that way. Oh, I see. Alright, I wanna go over here. Let's go up here. This one's broken. You don't have the right chalk? And there's a broken bridge here that I have a feeling we're gonna wanna fix at some point. Okay. So I need chalk and I can't go that way, but I can go up more. I'm gonna have a ton of these. Okay, I can't see. <gasps> Ooh. I can't do anything. I can't do anything. All right, well, this is here, I guess. I can't do anything with it, though. Okay. Let's go back down. That rope across there is also broken. All right, let's go up here. <gasps> Wait. The nucleus. I can see it. Can I take these away enough for me to... You can temporarily get rid of the vines with weed terminator potion, but they'll grow back after a while. Then what do I do? Find the core. Okay, but the core's on the other side. Got a piece of rock. Yeah, I can't get to them. And I can't do anything with you. Hmm. Okay. Let's go up here. 
There's a key we can do something with. Because that one down there is broken. Or I don't even know if this is a key? Why are there so many things blocking the path? This must be the forest with many secrets. <gasps> oh, I missed it. What's... Looks like... Looks like a barrier made with a witch pattern. Witch pattern? Is there a witch here? There was, or do you know how it works? School hammered it in my head. Shouldn't be an issue as long as it's drawn well. Ooh. Am I being raided? Hey! Welcome, dudes! We're playing a really cute game. Paige, thanks for subscribing. Meet me, thank you for subscribing. We're playing, um... Little Witch in the Woods. All right, we're gonna go up there in a second. <gasps> but there's like more things. Oh, I can't go over there actually, Never mind. Oh? Oh, I need another one of these to grow. Okay, so there's a lot of things that we're gonna be unlocking here. Well, let's go up. We found it! We found it, we found it, we found it, the big tree. Wow, it's the gigantic shining tree! The same one we saw from the train. Welcome everyone, thank you so much for the raid. Welcome. Hey, dudes! This is a bitter grape tea tree. I don't think the tree is the one that's shining. Check this out, Virgil. There are a ton of butterflies on it. You're right, the butterflies seem to be glowing. These are blue moon butterflies. What is Little Witch in the Woods? I don't know. <laughs> We're just playing it for the first time. The butterflies give off a subtle moonlight. The light from these butterflies has the same power as actual moonlight. That's why strange things always happen around these butterflies. Aren't they beautiful? A giant tree with butterflies glowing with moonlight? It's not just beautiful, it's an extremely fascinating sight to behold. Isn't this a pretty magnificent discovery? Did you know that those creatures, that those two are rare creatures? What, so what about it? The fact that those two are together is amazing. What about those two being together? They're usually raised together artificially to get moonflower in Lucerne or two. That must be a place. It's uncommon for them to be together naturally like this. Uh, anyway, we did find something, right? I guess so. I'll have to write a letter to the school later. Let's look around a bit more. Fill up the codex and all. Just don't be late. We must return to the train by tomorrow morning. Let's go back the way we came up. There might be other strange things. Okay. So... Retrace your path. Yeah, we did miss a lot of things on the way up. And there's a lot I can't do. I don't think I'll get a wink of sleep on the train. I wonder if there's any way I can sleep for tonight. What about the ground? The dirt and rocks should be nice for it. <laughs> should be a nice bed. That's not funny, Virgil. Oh? Look, the blue moon butterfly we saw at the peak is here too. They've been here. You might as well collect some for study purposes. So now we're gonna learn how, maybe. You think I could just sneak up and grab it? Wait, do you remember what Mr. Gravier said? Death lives under the bed? No, not that. Draw it before you touch it. That's right. <gasps> Change tools. Approach it and use the quill to draw it in the encyclopedia. Oh. Did I do it? Oh, I have to hold it. I'm dumb. Done. We've drawn him. Now I can open the encyclopedia, which I've already figured out. Blue Moon Butterfly. Okay. How to make collecting easier? Exit. Great! It's registered in the catalog. Let's see. Now, do you see why you can't catch any right now? A butterfly that emits a soft blue glow from absorbing moonlight. It is, a sen is sensitive to sound, but will not, but will not easily go away unless it feels especially threatened. Wait, do you see why you can't catch any right now? Because I don't have the tool. So you can collect them using a butterfly net. I don't have one right now. Not much you can do now then, but I want to do it right now. Getting to the witch's house in Highline is more important. <laughs> Let's go back down now. There's got to be something else that's fun. Okay, so... Cool. We can draw them. Have I gone this way? 
I can't climb up that, but we didn't go this way. <gasps> Ooh. Oh, I can't go this way either. Man, I guess these get unlocked later. There was some more that we couldn't do down here. Did I go this way? Oh, no. We, oh. Did I go all the way? <gasps> you good? Oh my god, that was scary. Oh wait, I can jump this. There we go. What's up here? Nothing. That's where we could have dropped down. That's like a little shortcut. Oh, there's... <gasps> what are you? Are you kidding? It's not gonna let me observe this? What is that? Excuse me? Oh, wow, okay. What is that? Oh? Stop moving. Oh, oh my gosh. Bush bug. Makes homes within bushes. They have uncharacteristically long, large wings for such a tiny body. Should you see a moving bush, try giving it a good shake. They are not difficult to gather once spotted, but you need a net, so. What are these? Okay, I'm not able to investigate that at all, which is weird. And I can't go this way. I don't. I think I went this way already. Yeah, we did this. We gotta go all the way back down. <gasps> I'm in love! 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 Oh, wow! Ellie, let's go back to the train. Look at that, Virgil! A shining white cat! I've never seen anything like that before. Oh, we'll have to chase it. Ellie, we have to... Let's go after that creature! Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Where'd you go? <gasps> I'm coming! Hey! Stop! Oh. Apparently I can pick up sticks. What's this? Okay. If I can't pick it up, we draw it to find out what it is. Sil Silver star bell. I also need a net. To catch it? Silver bell-shaped flower also produces a mellow sound like that of a bell. The echoes from the flower evokes a melancholy feeling from within. The buds bloom only at night when there is when there is a light. The pollen that bursts from the bud. Oh, those are the ones I stepped on earlier because I couldn't do anything else. <gasps> Hello? Wait! This looks like chalk. I think the cat dropped something and left. What's this? Looks like a witch chalk. That thing you use to draw things like a pattern? It looks a little different from the one we were using at school. It's just a different packaging. It's too dark and worn down for me to see anything. I don't see any words, only pictures. Let's come back when it's brighter. Okay. Do you see these children? Wait. Should I draw this one? Because I haven't drawn it before. Which flower? There we go. We can grab it with our hands. Um. Cool. Look at these little guys up here on the cliff. They're just like, there. Let's focus on what we're doing now. All right, I'm not focused though, so let me do what I want. Cool, okay. All right, fine. The switch pattern seems to have been erased a bit. It won't work if it gets erased like this. You can draw the pattern again using the same color witch chalk. Since I have the one I picked up earlier, let's draw it again with that. Should I draw the witch pattern again using one witch's white chalk? Yes. I drew the witch pattern. Ooh. I'm following that cat. <gasps> Where did the cat go? Look, Virgil, there's a house. There's a witch's house, isn't it? That's a witch's house, isn't it? It looks pretty old. I guess we can talk to the master witch here and stay here for a while. It doesn't look like there are people inside. If there's no one, I might stay for a while. Isn't it natural for an apprentice witch to be at a witch's house? That's true, but... I wouldn't mind taking- maybe later. Okay, I was like, wait. <gasps> I 
I found one! Oh, <gasps> Sir? Where did you go? Um... Did that happen before when I plucked it and I didn't realize? Oh my goodness, that was spooky. Look, it's another one. There's a little statue. Okay, let's go inside. Anyone there? Is anybody there? Seems like nobody's here. It could be an abandoned witch's house. Oh, you couldn't see? Well, there's a little man that ran into the woods after I plucked the thing. Like a little, a little guy. I don't really know. Um... <laughs> There's nowhere for my face to be that is convenient, so I'm gonna just stay here and we're all gonna suffer. Uh, because the witch administration can't figure out everything. Alright, let's go inside. Um. <gasps> oh, it really is an abandoned witch's house. Taking that into consideration, it looks okay. Although it's not that clean. Since the witch's house is managed on her own, I'm reading so you don't have to worry about not being able to read the words either because there's just nowhere else for me to be. <laughs> it doesn't seem to be in a very good condition considering how dirty it is. But the bed looks fine. I guess I can just sleep here. Since the witch's house is a public institution, it's okay to sleep one night or so. And it's better than sleeping outside. Stamina. Okay. Oh, I need to recover stamina by eating or sleeping. Also, I have a feeling we're gonna miss the train. <laughs> I have this, this suspicion. Oh, can I clean? The house is a bit messy. We'll just sleep. Oh, I can't clean it. Well, that's, I wanted to. I can't clean up. All right, there's nothing. I guess let's sleep. There's nothing else to do. Oh, is this the cat? Is this a dream? <gasps> um, what's with that face? You slept on a nice fluffy bed. Yes, but I dreamt that I was sleeping on the train. All that up, I, we gotta go! All that effort not to sleep on the train, only the dream of just that. You should have just slept on the train. No, that's not it. I slept very well, actually. I can hear, I can almost hear the sound of the train. Wait, isn't that actually the sound of the train? What, really? Is it taking off already? Let's hurry! I think we're late. I think we're missing it. It really is the sound of the train. I think it's about to take off. Let's hurry back. You'd think they'd give a warning boop in case someone left in the morning to like go pee or something? Glad I didn't sleep in. Okay, we have to run. What are you? I got it, that was first. That's the squishy chub and I can catch one? Okay, not now. Let's go. We gotta go, we gotta go, we gotta go, we gotta go. We're gonna be late. We're so late. We're so in trouble. I don't remember how I got in here. I think it was this way. This is the path. Run, run, run. Please don't leave. Huh? Uh-oh. Where's the train? Looks like that bird was imitating train sounds. But where's the train? It probably went to High Lion. Well, then what do we do now? Let's look around the area. I'm sure we'll find some clues. Why are you so calm? I've been through much worse with your mom. So this must be our mom's hat. We must have inherited... I'm gonna need you to stop. Oh. What is that thing? It's called the Gaga Bird. They say it's a bit insane. Quiet. I don't want to hear it. It's your fault for oversleeping. Don't blame the Gaga Bird. Fine, whatever. Just be quiet. All right. I am going to uh, run quickly and pee. I will be right back.
Okay, let's go find what happened to the train. Uh, we have a letter right over here. A letter! How nice of them to leave a letter behind. There were only two people on this train. How did they not be like, let's give a warning to, because we're missing someone. Hmm. I think it's a letter from the bartender on the train. You're probably shocked to see that the train is gone. A witch suddenly appeared in the middle of the night and got rid of the prickly vines. They said they can't wait because the train was already delayed, so we had to leave. I said that they didn't say they were leaving in the morning. They also said if they can leave right away, they will. But don't worry, the train will come back. There's a village nearby where I used to live. You can just spend some time there. There should be a sign in the forest, so take a look and go find the village. When you arrive at the village, please send a knight and art in my regards. Bartender. Oh, cool. Okay. Hmm. He said there's a village, Virgil. Are you even a little upset that we missed the train? There's a village nearby, but I can't imagine where it would be. We explored that area quite a lot yesterday. It was probably too dark to see. Let's look for it again. See if there is a sign as well. There was a sign somewhere. How about cleaning the witch's house? We might have to stay there until we find the village. Okay. Please try to not sound so excited. We missed the train, remember? Right. You heard me, right? Well, then I might as well add more to the encyclopedia now. Yeah, we have more things to go and look for, I guess. Let's go back. Let's just check. I want to go back to the witch's house. We have to log three more new things. I should have waited with those bunnies because I just kind of jumped the gun and logged it early. Let's go back to the witch's house first and clean it. Although, you know what? I never went this way. Wait, is this... Oh, I never went here. Huh. Okay, there's a well. A crayon apple. Eating will bring our stamina back, so... Oh, wait, I need to log the crayon apple. And this. I don't think I ever logged this. Oh, maybe I did, actually. Oh, I can't take it. Oh, there we go. Oh, maybe... Did I log the... Aw. There's the sign. But there's our... Can I grab you? <gasps> I grabbed him! I got from it. Ooh. Oh, they only come out at night. Okay. Well, that's probably the sign that shows us where the town is. The witch's house is right above us. And then there's more to the left and the top left. So the town lies to the east of here. I guess people do live around here. All right, then let's head east. But it seems to be blocked by something over there. That's true. It's little honey pumpkin. Let's go take a look first. I also haven't logged that. Can I not log it, I guess? I think this is the way to the village, but the little honey pumpkin is in the way. Let's go to the witch's house and find a way and also clean up. Yeah, we'll do that. All right, we logged the bunnies. I got some fur from them, which was cool. I've logged those. What's this over here? Hiding up. Did it just change? Am I crazy? That looked different when I went over there before. Okay. That's fine. Oh, here. Can I try to... Nope, there's nothing in that one. <gasps> here. Can I log these? No, it's not letting me. I don't think I need to. Okay, let's go back to the witch's house. I don't have anything new to log right now. Let's get rid of the weed first. There's too much. It would take forever to pull this out using hands. Take a look at in the bin over there. It might have a potion to get rid of the weed. Bro, what bin? 
this. There's nothing here. Then we'll have to use another tool. Is there another tool? Yes, there is a wonderful tool. What's that? Your hands. <laughs> Hi, Koji! What are we picking? What, what are we picking? What weeds? Which weeds are we picking? Also, there's a sack here, but I can't do anything with that. Oh, wait. I don't have my hands out. Hello. Now, I don't suppose I can doodle that. No. We just have to pull them. This is kind of fun, though. I don't mind. We do literally have to yank each one out by hand. Honestly satisfying. I could play an entire game of just simply cleaning. I will have to eat because my stamina is going down pretty fast now. Are these weeds? Oh, I have to sweep too. I can take a nap. This place is gonna look so good. Jeremy Pluff, thanks for subscribing. Live Ravs. Uh, LDT, need me. Thank you guys for subscribing. All right, there's a bunch here. I wanna know about these little men statues. They look like they're from Princess Mononoke. All right, I think I got rid of all of them, right? It's nice to see that it's clean. Now it's time to tidy up the house. Right, let's do that. Look, Ellie, it's a quest mark. All I see is dust and cobwebs that we have to clean up. Exactly. Let's find something useful while cleaning. The cat, perhaps? Oh, it's a notebook. Might be useful later. May I have it? I wonder where the witch is, the one who lived here. This place is probably very old. She must be eating and living well somewhere in Lucerne or two. That must be like the main place. She really messed up the house. It reminds me of your room. My room was cleaner than this. That might be so from a dust standpoint. Okay. It's a witch bookshelf. Technically, it's a bookshelf that the witch was using. That's the same as a witch bookshelf. I'm not going to read a book, though. I'm tired of books. A poisonous mushroom is better than a witch who doesn't read books. What does that mean? Because a poisonous mushroom kills just one person. Stop nagging. I've read... I read enough books at school. Hmm, witch history. The 12 planets. Wait. <laughs> the 12 plants. Fun book of plants. Gardening for witches. There are so many books on plants. I guess a witch who used to research plants was living here. Me. My kind of witch. I should store any books I get in here. All done cleaning. It's also messy in front of the desk over there, Ellie. Stop bossing me around. I finally managed to get out of school. There's some dust over there, Ellie. Don't leave food behind, Ellie. I told you not to go inside the principal's office, Ellie. You should have listened. Oh, this is a witch elevator. That's why you have to listen to the teachers. Let's hurry up and go down. What if it's a scary monster? You think so? Oh, I'm excited. Wait, I want to investigate. Oh. Dude, I'm out of room. Let me perhaps eat. Oh, that's as hard. Oh, that was a waste. There goes my low stamina. Ooh. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <gasps> More cleaning! Look at this, Virgil. This must be the dispensary. You can probably make potions with the proper tools. We should definitely do some cleaning. Wow, cleaning again. I should gonna have something to say after I clean everything. Maybe more thank you for subscribing. I know what this is. It's an extractor. We used it so many times at school. I was, it was a slightly smaller one, though. It would be hard to use. Look at the glass bottle underneath. Oh, that's true. It's broken. I'll need a friendly toad at least. I'll need to get a glass bottle first in order to use this. You need, at least, you need to at least fix the extractor in order to make potions. Let's go to the village first. Let's look for one. Okay, we have a lot of things. 
This is fine. We have to find a glass bottle in town and we have to finish cleaning. So we'll stay here and finish cleaning first. What's this? Oh, more fur. <gasps> I didn't need it. Witch flower extract. <gasps> no chance we need to like draw that. No, okay. I have too much stuff. What is this one? It doesn't let me even know. Okay. Dude. I don't know why people have white screens. Um, it's not anything I can help you with because it isn't happening on my end. It's happening on your end. Maybe a refresh, maybe a pop the screen out or something. A roaster. Oh, I hate this thing. You have to put in the ingredients and just wait. It's awful. Can you simply put them in and do something else while you're waiting? It seems to be in bad condition, however. Really? Oh, yes. There is no handle for winding the spring. Whether... Where would I get a roaster handle? I don't need the roaster since it is not needed for the basic recipes. And there should be something when you get to the village. Yeah, the village comes first. By the way, there's nothing normal here. It would be rather strange to be normal when it's dirty like this. I don't know what that's supposed to mean. I can't pick that up. I grabbed too many things. The spilled bottle, scribbled paper, and a book. What a mess. Just brush off the dust. Just brushing off the dust might make, might take a lifetime. What's this? Lunar's oil. Looks like a recipe for a potion. I guess it was used by the witch who was here. Ooh, it reads, a potion with the power of moon. The ingredients of are moonflower and phoenix feather. Very expensive materials. I'll use it someday. Let's have it ready for now. There's also something underneath. Where? Oh, you're right. I don't know what kind of text this is. You learned it at witch, at school, the ancient witch language. <gasps> you mean I learned how to read these strange symbols? Your score wasn't bad either. I don't remember anything. Shall we take a look anyway? Looks like a recipe. It seems like moon's something. I have no idea, I've got a headache. Take a look if you remember later. Why can't I remember reading this language? I should put it away and revisit it later. This desk would be nice to use as a workbench later. There's no use for it now. Oh, I have a bunch of new things in here. Weed Terminator Potion, we finally found out how to make. And soon we'll be able to do it and then unlock more of the forest. We just need the glass bottle now. Okay, cool. Uh, this needs to be cleaned. Wow, this is a pretty good cauldron. I think it was made by the Blue Lightning Workshop. Its style is very traditional. I've only ever used the cheap cauldrons at school. Finally, I get to use a good one. Do you remember how to use one? Of course. Expertly processed ingredients, the exact heat intensity, and the right ladling technique. And at last. At last, you'll end up with a proper potion. Okay, we'll learn how to do that when we have the bottle to get us started. I actually liked Teacher Olivia. Still, the cauldron looks fine. You'll be able to make a potion if you have the ingredients. The machine tools are in bad condition, though. Since there are some discarded ingredients, let's... Oh, we do need it. We can make it now. <gasps> let's focus on what we're doing now. Isn't that using this? Hello? <gasps> can I get rid of... I don't need sticks. Now, what is this? This is a potion ingredient, isn't it? You use them in school countless times. Are witches usually this sloppy? Sloppy or not, they're careful with their ingredients. Then I guess the witch that lived here was really sloppy. Or she was in a hurry. Why? Beats me. Okay, well, I can't use that. It won't let me. Ooh. This box looks pretty useful. I can put stuff in here when my pockets are full. Yes, I'm all done cleaning! We can make potions now. It would be hard to make properly because the machine tools are broken. Since there were ingredients on the ground, let's try making them for now. There was a little honey pumpkin in front of the village. The stubborn weed elimination potion should do it. It's a weed terminator potion. Whatever. Check the recipe in the encyclopedia. You'll probably be able to make it with the ingredients you were lucky enough to find. Let's do it. Ooh, we're gonna learn how to use a cauldron. D. So we're making, we need... 
Squishy chub fur extract and witch flower extract. The recipe is shown in detail on the page to the right. Okay, well, I can see that. There, those are the ingredients. Okay. So that's how you get those things, which I don't need to do. Put two squishy chub fur in an, the extractor and squeeze the juice. So we already have the extract, though, because we found it on the ground. But that's how we would get it otherwise. And we have the other ingredients, but we can't use the extractor because that's broken. Um, set fire to stage four. What? <laughs> stir the ladle, don't stir. What does that mean? After processing the clay... Okay. Well, we're gonna put in, um... Oh, try crafting? I, I see. Let me do it. There we go. We need witch flower extract, and we need squishy fur extract. Um... Press and hold. Ooh! We terminate a potion. All right, we're gonna use this on town so we can get the glass bottle and then we can make more potions like this for the rest of the forest. Let's go throw it at the little honey pumpkin. You must use it carefully since there are no more ingredients. Yeah, if I went and used it on the wrong one. You must throw it at, at the little honey pumpkin and make sure to remove all the nucleus as well. It is only a temporary measure. Got it. Oh, equipped a potion? Okay. Let's go back up. You can now save and load from the cabinet on the first floor of the witch's house. What should I do? Save. Saved. You can now take naps. You cannot take naps at night. You can only take a nap once per day. That's to get energy back. Okay, let's go. Down. So this is where we need to use it on. So, equipped potion. See? Oh, aim. How do I move my aim? get it oh what oh I see that's just where it stops okay here it goes good I think it's working properly pass by quickly and remove the nucleus lovely now we get to go into town how's my my inventory is allowing me to get some more stuff oh <gasps> This isn't a village. Look over there, Ellie. It's a prickly vine this time. It's so huge and thick. Oh no. What do I do with the extractor? First, take a look around here. Aurea? Hello, do you live in town? Nature is so beautiful. Oh, I love her. She's beautiful. What? Are the tree Aren't the trees beautiful? Their green leaves are so pretty. Oh, sure. Nature is so breathtaking. You must love nature. How can you not? Okay, I'll be back. Walk under the blue sky and experience nature. She must be really, she must really love nature. So much that she can't have a conversation? You should respect her interests. I think it's more of an obsession. Something didn't feel right. You think she's cursed or something? A curse that doesn't, doesn't allow her to talk about anything except nature? The curse of a nature lover? That doesn't make sense. There are lots of quirky witches out there. The curse lifting candy can lift the curse... Should be a basic recipe, but we can't use the machining tool. Okay, so we still can't do that either. I must process what's been collected to make potion. What should I do? You picked up several ingredients at the workplace earlier, didn't you? There's some subtitled problems. There's Those would be enough to make curse lifting candy. And did you see what's next to her over there? Next to her? What? It's a glass bottle. That would be perfect as a glass extractor bottle. Where? Whoa, you weren't kidding. 
All right, now let's make cur curse lifting candy. That would be nice. First, let's check on the candy that can lift the curse in the book. Okay. So, curse lifting candy is this one. We need squishy chub fur extract and maple herb extract. We have both of those already. Okay. I have to go back. Take a look at that huge, oh, fine. I thought we had to make the thing. Wow, they really are big. Too big for the weed termination potion, I think. We'll have to do something else. We'll have to stay at the witch's house for a while. Okay, so we have a lot of things now. Wisteria. The village is just ahead. Okay. It won't let me take this yet. She won't talk to me. But I have... Wait. If I want to make the candy... Oh, I see. Okay. So... Curse lifting candy, but we don't stir. Stir the ladle, don't stir. I don't understand what they're supposed to do. I think we go back to the potion place to make the candy. Do 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 That's this way. Going down. So we have this guy and this guy. Ladle direction? What? Fire strength? Oh. I don't know how to make this one. <laughs> Wait, I should check. Fire stage three, don't stir. Okay, I see. So. Put these in, we put these in, we do fire stage three, and we don't stir. So we just begin crafting. Yay! We did it! Go back up! Let's do another quick save. And back to where the village is. Excuse me? Pumpkin Terrier? <gasps> oh, and I can grab it and get Pumpkin Terrier fur. Why won't it let me grab them? Oh, I see. <gasps> you do run. Jeez, that was hard to get. Okay. You have, and then he went away. Oh, it's getting dark too. Okay, let's go. No, we don't wanna. Shall I give her the care lifting candy? Give. Would you like to try this? May the blessings of nature be with you. Hello? Yes, hello. Am I speaking properly now? Yes, I think so. Wow, thank you so much. To hell with nature! I guess it really was a curse. I could tell the old man I met in the western jungle was suspicious just by looking at him, yet I simply couldn't ex ignore such a well-made wooden image of a monkey. After I bought it, I could only talk about praising nature. I tried to speak backwards, right, but I could only praise nature. Pure torture. I hope nature just rots and dies. Still, I'm glad it w the curse was easily removed. Thank you so much. My name is Aria. How long has it been since I said my name? My name is Ellie. I'm an apprentice witch. Did you come to this town to be an apprentice? 
I was on a train, but I got off for a moment and it left without me. Oh dear. I was about to enter the town, but it's blocked off by some prickly vines. Damn nature. Oh, 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 oh no, oh no, a swear. Oh, the children. Oh God. Uh, thankfully we found an empty witch's house nearby, so I've been staying there. An empty... Oh, so there's a witch house here. That's good. I've... Business in the village, too, but the vine stopped me. I'll be here for a while, so let me know if you need anything. Can I ask you a favor? Not a favor, but a fair price. What do you need? The tools were broken when I was trying to use the dispensary at the witch's house. Do you have any tools or parts? What kind of tools or parts? I need a glass bottle for the extractor and a roaster handle for the winding... For winding the roaster. Wait a minute, I'll look for them. Sure, but Ellie, do you have any money? I do. Mom gave me pocket money when I came out. Good for you. You think you'll be able to buy witch tools with just enough pocket money to buy a snack or two? Is that so? What if I don't have enough money? Since you have tools, make and sell potions or something. You can always sell the candies. We just cured her. You think she could do us one solid? Only if there are people to buy them. I found it! Take this. There's a glass bottle. How much is this? Oh, never mind. This is a return for breaking my curse. Uh, give me one second. This is, okay, good. I was like, we gave you a candy for free. <laughs> well, thank God. Unfortunately, I don't have any roaster handle for the roaster. I see. Will you be staying at the village? If so, I'll bring it next time. I'll sell it at a proper price then, however. Good, please bring it then. Okay, I'll write roaster handle in the memo. And take this too. Healing candy. Since the price for the bottle earlier wasn't enough, I'll give this to you as well. Thank you. Sure, come back next time. Now we'll be able to fix the extractor. Are you really going to stay in this village? I should until the train comes. Really? I have no choice. No, I mean, are you really going to leave when the train comes? That? I'll decide when that happens. What if I don't go to school? Let's fix the extractor first. What if I just ditched school? Alright, let's go back. It's starting to get dark. There's also so many potions we can make now for, um... Which way am I supposed to go? This way? There were so many other paths we couldn't take. But now, with the extractor, I can get more things from the forest and more potions and discover more things. Oh wait, that's not what we're doing. Should I use the glass bottle I have for the extractor? Yes. Now I can use the extractor. Cool. Then what do I do now? Didn't you want to go to the village? You should remove the gigantic prickly vine. That's true, but... It seems impossible to get rid of that huge thing with the recipe I have now. The basic recipe does seem kind of inadequate. What's your plan? Now that the extractor has been fixed, you'll be able to make potions from the basic recipes. If you make weed terminator potion, you can get rid of little honey pumpkin. I'll be able to go to the places that have been blocked. A little more. A little more, yeah, so the forest. I don't know what I was supposed to say. Let's look through the forest. There must be something. That's what I'm saying. Oh, so I can pick my sticks back up. Uh, and we can store things in here. So let's put move all. I'm going to keep those on me. And I'm going to keep this guy on me. It's getting late, though. I don't know. Well, what's the recipe for the... Um Squishy chub fur extract and witch flower extract. I can do that already, I think. 
Um, two fur and two witch flower. Oh, I might not have two fur. I only have one fur, and those guys go away at nighttime, so I might miss them to get another one. I might have to go to... Oops, I went back down. <laughs> that was an accident. Go back up. Let's go. Let's see if I can catch one. <gasps> Caw? A crow? Witch! Caw! It spoke? It's a witch's crow. Oh, it's a witch's crow. The witch returns! The witch returns! This is my first time coming here, though. The witch returns! Not exactly a listener, is he? Goods and services, caw. Goods and services, witch's catalog. The witch's catalog? I've always wanted to try it out. You need to head towards High Lion, young lady. But I can't just starve until I reach the village. After I find the village, I'm going to make sure I try it out before I go to High Lion. Limited time only. Register now for a gift. Try the witch's catalog. They're handing out gifts. Plus, it's limited time only. Multi-purpose glue, kitchen accessories, a spork. In any case, I need the witch's catalog. I guess it wouldn't hurt to have a pinch. You can buy ingredients or potion recipes from them. All right, let's register for now. Thank you, Ka. Thank you, visit employee. Visit employee. What does that mean? When? Work finished. Work finished. Closed for the day. Closed for the day. Goodbye. So suddenly? It's not easy getting the message across to witches' crows. Then I guess I should keep searching for the village. You never know when the witches' catalog will show up. Let's stick to the plan and find the village. All right, let's see if we can still... Yeah. Sweet. That's all we needed was one more. Now I can make the potion. What's this one? <gasps> what, how do I, how do I get to the other side? An unreadable memo, healing candy. Oh, these are my inventory, I'm just dumb. So wait, can I use both of these? Oh my god, I didn't even... Wait, hello? When did these get here? I just realized it's not my inventory, but how do I... That can stay there, I guess? Okay, now I learned the recipe. Okay, I don't know when they got into that chest though. Let's get... We have a potion to make. Which flower extract? Cool. Oh, those are key items. How do I get to them? I can only access them from the chest if my inventory is full. I don't know what kind of text this is. I learned ancient witch apparently though. Okay, before I make this, oh, there's the healing candy. Weed terminator potion, stage four, don't stir. Monster. I love the little face it makes. Okay. I think, though, it's getting to be too nighttime. I mean, maybe not. It doesn't really matter what time it is. It is nighttime, though. I want to go all the way back to the original one. It's another one of those guys. There's a lot of those guys. Maybe it was down more? 
No, that's... Okay, so the original path that was blocked was here. Oh, no. This one's not even a... It's the next one. Not there. Those ingredients from those guys are hard to get. Here. No! That one also wasn't. Okay. We have to find the one that's packed specifically by... a pumpkin. We're gonna have so much witch flower. Also have so much maple stuff, too. Virgil, look at that! It's grown so much. It wasn't that big a while ago. That must be an adult honey pumpkin. We better get rid of it before it grows anymore. What? I'm not even a gardener. Why? We must get rid of it to get to a new place since we haven't been behind there. I guess I should make the potion. I thought I did already. Wait, did I not do it? No, I have it already. I'm just ahead of the game. Um, A? Wait, why can't I go? Oh my god, I was freaking out for a second. I was like, why can't I go through? Hey, you're not allowed to be here. You're supposed to... That's fine. Whoa. Wait, there's a fox in the web over there. I gotta go help him. 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 Oh, wait, I can't get down there. Oh, no. Well, this is unfortunate. Oh, oh, oh. Rub rum? Wow, Virgil, there's... Oh, my God, he's precious. I think he's lost consciousness. His eyes are wide open to me. I don't know. Is he even alive? I don't know. Um, gah. They woke up. Who? I'm Ellie, an apprentice witch. A witch? Wow, this is my first time me seeing an apprentice witch. It's my first time seeing someone caught in a spider web. Hee <laughs> hee. My name is Rubrum. I live in the village with my grandma, but now I'm stuck in a big spider web. He doesn't seem to understand the gravity of his situation. A big spider web means there's a big spider nearby. <gasps> you be quiet. Don't worry, you'll be fine. I'll help you down. You have to be careful with dealing with spider webs, Ellie. It looks pretty strong. One wrong move, and you'll get stuck in it yourself. Then what do I do? Maple herb works best against insects. Just one maple herb should be enough. If it is maple herb, I have it. Like this. Oh! Perfect. I've just been grabbing stuff. He's so cute. Are you okay? Yeah, probably. Can you walk? Okay. Then let's go to the witch's house together. Oh, he's my little buddy now. Look at the statue here. That's terrifying. Okay. You, you come with me now, little guy. And I can't go this way. But I can see where it connects to. Okay. Come on, keep up. I don't want to leave you behind. He's so little and cute. There he is. Okay. Oh, wait. Are you okay? Are you hurt? I can't walk because my legs hurt. You were probably up there for too long. Then I'll give you a hug. I'll give you treatment at the witch's house. Oh. All right, we gotta go straight there. Wait, I'm lost. This is not the way. We gotta go down. Oh, I'll take that though. No, I won't, I'm busy, my hands are full. Can't be concerned with the bush. Isn't it heavy? Isn't it heavy? Of course. Really? Just stop talking. 
Am I even going the right way this time? I feel like I'm not. Oh yeah, I am. Oh, thank God. Our village is just a little further from here, but you cannot pass through now because of the prickly vines. Let's go to the witch's house for now and find a way. We're on the way. My stamina is low. We're gonna wanna go to bed soon. We're here. Wow, a witch's house. Thanks. How's your leg? It still hurts a bit. I have to hurry up and get back to the village. If not, Grandma will scold me. You almost got eaten. I think she won't mind. Okay, leave it to me. I'll get rid of that huge prickly vine. Whoa, really? I'll make sure to get you back to your village. Don't worry. Okay, thanks. For that, I should treat your leg. Wait here for a moment. What am I supposed to do about it? Oh. Healing candy. We need maple herb and witch flower extract. All right, and then we gotta go to bed because I'm exhausted. Okay, let's see. So we need two witch flower, two maple herb. Which I have the witch flower. I just need to grab the maple herb, which should be in here. So we need the extract first. Wait, what was the maple herb extract? Oh, it's just down here. Okay, now let's see how to make the healing candy is Clockwise, stirring, and stage four, fire. So, stage four, fire, and clockwise is this way. I wonder what would happen if I did it wrong. All right, we got the healing candy. That should be the thing he needs. Would you like to try this? What's this? Is this candy? Yeah, it's a candy to heal your leg. Thanks, it looks delicious. Oh, it's delicious. Oh, this tastes awful. It's good for your health. How's your leg? Well, I think I feel better. Thanks, Ellie. That, the candy tastes awful. So how did you get caught in the spider web? I just came to the forest to play for a little bit, but time flew by and then a giant, the giant prickly vines were covering the way. I was looking for another path when I heard the sound of a train. Oh, it must be the one I was riding. I went towards the train and a strange bird suddenly started chasing after me. It must have been that bird, not the train. It was that bird. I went into a deep place as I was running away. Then I found a treasure map and got caught in a spider web as I was trying to pick it up. Treasure map! I saw a picture of a skeleton through the bushes. I saw in a children's book that it's a sign of pirates leaving their treasure. Shall we go check? What about the gigantic prickly vine? Oh, well, we can't do much about it yet. It wouldn't hurt to try. Let's go. Can I follow you too? Wouldn't it be better to rest a little more? I'm bored since I'm at home all the time. What do you say? Okay, fine. Be careful. I kind of feel like I need to sleep, though. Yeah, we'll do this tomorrow. Groan. You just woke up. Why do you look dead already? I think I had an important dream, but I can't remember it. It seemed like something important. Like the principal sermon? That's something I don't want to think about again. Let's... I like playing in the forest. You have to be careful. Will you follow me? Oh. All right, I think we're done. I think he's gonna follow us. Oh, there he is. Okay, good. So where do we need to go? treasure map where he was caught in the web. So let's go there. Do, 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 do. I'm going to assume he can catch up to me. I don't need to worry about gathering any materials right now because we're good. Oh, that's wrong. I'm going to go up here now. <gasps> Whoops. Should have drawn. Oh, oh, oh. 
Got him. Look at the little sprout on their head. Sprout bird. A common bird found in the green forest a sprout on its head will shrivel up or bloom with flowers. They drop their flowers behind should you scare them away. Too late. I have to let it bloom first. The other one didn't drop anything. Are there more? Wait for the flower, maybe? <laughs> okay, we can't go... Oh, I can't go this way. Okay. Let's go to where we're supposed to be. I'll try to get the flower eventually. Here's the bridge. Food is always good. A boom potion? I even went to a hidden library because I wanted to make it. I'm so lucky to find this here. They don't normally use a skeleton design as a symbol of luck, right? The important thing now is that I have something to blow things up with. And also something to blow up. You're super excited. Then shall we go try it right away? We're blowing up the gate? I didn't even examine the gate yet. Oh, that! <laughs> oh. I miss this feeling. Oops. Do you plan to destroy everything on top of getting in tr trouble? Hey, what do you take me for? Boom potion? Don't you feel the almighty power just from the name? When in trouble, throw it. Break it if you can't have it. Sometimes it takes boldness to overcome a crisis. Don't you think it's strange that a boom potion was dropped in that secluded forest? Someone might have hidden it thinking it's treasure, like rub rum. Or someone might have spilt it. I don't know, the important thing is that the boom potion is in my hands. Go, boom potion! Wow, it won't even budge. It must be stronger than the secret door in the principal's office. What are those fragments coming out of it? Look at this, Virgil! It's a prickly vine fragment. It seems to have worked a little bit, but the vines appear to have grown back pretty fast. We might be able to figure out exactly what these prickly vines are. They aren't even in the codex. How are you going to figure that out? Well, wouldn't a person living around here know something? Let's show the fragment to someone and ask them about it. Rub rum. Is this a prickly vine fragment? Fascinating. Do you happen to know something about it? No, I don't. Oh, okay. Well, that we're done here. Goodbye. Ma'am. Do you know something about it? No, I don't know anything about prickly vines either, but I have something that might be helpful. A universal product appraisal machine. Well, what's that? It's a tool made by some witch. With the power of the moon, of the moonstone embedded in here, you can find out the identity of any object. Really? Then hurry up and try it. I don't usually do this for free, but since you lifted my curse, I'll do it for free this time. Well, that's great. All right, here it goes. Huh? What? The prickly vine fragment has disappeared. That's strange. Why did it disappear? Maybe because of a grudge against nature? No, that's not possible. This tool just shoots moonlight and analyzes the reflected light. There are no plants that just get killed by moonlight, right? A plant that gets killed by moonlight. It seems like something's coming up in my mind. Think, Ellie, this is something you learned in school. Oh, I remember now. Avoiding the moon, there are plants that get killed by moonlight. But it's been there since nighttime. That's right, this prickly vine definitely avoids the moon. That's why it died in the moonlight. But, but, but the big one didn't. I think I've learned, I've heard of plants like that. I'm glad the tool is working fine. Thank you, I need to get rid of the prickly vines now. Uh, don't need anything else. See you next time. But how do you kill this? Well, let's go back to where he got stuck in the web because we didn't end up ever actually going. We didn't end up going all the way. Do, 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 do. He'll catch up. Do, do, do. Wrong way. 
Is it this way? No. Here he is. Oh. It keeps dying too fast for me to be able to... That's not going the way it's supposed to, but let's go back down here. Wait a minute. Oh, I already saw that. I forgot. Oh, I need chalk? Well, that's what I didn't get to investigate. What kind of tea do I like? Don't like tea. Let's drink tea together next time. All right, I guess. Okay, well, I guess that was it. That was the, the treasure and we can't do anything without the right chalk. So let's see. Let's see if there's anywhere else that we can destroy vines at. And we'll go make a potion. There's a symbol over there, but we can't get up to it. I don't know if I can investigate this yet. No. This is blocked off, not by a pumpkin. And there's nothing else up here. Oh. I didn't know if you'd want to talk about the things we're looking at at all, but I guess not. Okay, let's get out of here. We gotta find a way. Oh, these died. Were they dead before? And I can't get across here. Oop, that's, that was an accident. What do we got? What do we got? Weed Terminator potion. That's not gonna work. And that's the only potion we have. We have healing candy, cough candy, soft candy, Alleviates muscle pain. Back scratcher candy. And that's it. And I can't fix that. And I can't go there. So let's see if I haven't found... What else can we do? Search the drawers. Oh, okay. That's what we need to do. Alright, let's go back to the witch's house. I got one. Oh, I got one. Flower that grows, it has a faint scent of a spring. I don't know if that's f for anything, but I got one. Oops. Oh, this is a dead end, but, but. So you have to wait for them to, oh, I was too slow. I see though. All right, let's go back. Do, 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 <coughs> do. I got a bird flower. Save. Oh, wait. Drawers. Well, I've already checked everything, though. We can't use the roaster. All right, the drawer's upstairs then. Maybe the the bookshelf. Oh, you you shouldn't be standing there. Let's get this started. The moonflower. We need a net. That's what we need. People have died from reading too many books, haven't they? So much for all that confidence. I actually have a disease that kills me if I read too many books, you know. Stop complaining and keep searching. You've only gone through three books so far. Only? Come on, look at the size of these books. It's too much work. Can't you read instead? You sh sure you want to do that? Of course, we're friends, right? Looks like the next few lines are about the moonflower. 
<laughs> what, really? Let's see here. Bitter grape tea tree? Bitter grape tea tree. That's the tree we saw at the summit, the glowing one. The glow came from the moon, blue moon butterflies. The tea leaves, blah, blah, blah. Tastes like grapes, strong bitter taste. Oh, here it is. It also is famous for its flowers, the moon flower. So it was here. There's still more information. It gathers moonlight most of the time, and on a moonless night, the moon flower blooms. A moonless night. But the tree at the summit had blue moon butterflies flying around. So the moon flower couldn't bloom because of the moonlight emitted by the blue moon butterflies. So if we get rid of the blue moon butterflies, then the moon flower will bloom. Yeah, it's commonly used method back in Lucerine or two. Gather moonlight with the blue moon butterflies, shoo them away, and collect the moon flower. All right, let's get rid of the blue moon butterflies, make Lunar's oil, and remove the prickly vines. But what do we use to get rid of the blue moon butterflies? They don't like sunlight, so sunlight potion should work. Oh. Sunlight potion. Witch flower, squishy chub fur, and maple herb. Two of each. I think I need, let's check my ingredients. Yeah, I have two maple. And I need two fur. Let's put this guy in here and these in here. And this. I'm keeping these. I don't know what to do with them. All right, so we need to go get fur before it's nighttime, but it's only 2 p.m., so we're fine. I love that the little fox is just gonna follow us. Do 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 do. Got him. And another one. That's enough. Let's go get all our extractions. He's stuck there. He's literally stuck there. He can't get out. Uh oh. Okay. Maple herb extract. Lizzie Bear, thank you for subscribing. Meep anymore, thank you for the sub. That was a while ago. I might have missed it. Fur extract and witch flower extract. Now, stage five and clockwise. And clockwise. I have a feeling it makes an angry face when you do it wrong, but I don't want to waste ingredients. The sunlight potion is ready. Let's get to the tree right away. Ellie, the lunar oil is... Don't worry, I already have the ingredients. You already have them? First is the moonflower. Do you really want to go now? Did you do everything you want to do? Yeah. There's nothing more to do. Let's go. I don't know what she started to say. Oh, I see. You can spend more time in the day going and getting more things, but I didn't want to. Great. They're stuck to the tree as expected. Wow, there are tons of shining butterflies. You're going to make them all go away now, right? I feel so bad for them all of a sudden. It's for the tree's sake. Hurry up and sprinkle the potion. Okay, here it goes. Ooh. Whoa! Wow, it's beautiful. Where are those butterflies going? Wouldn't they go back to where they came from? But the flower... Oh, over there, over there! Whoa! I didn't expect it to be pink. It's so beautiful. Yes, it's really, really beautiful. Now we can just pick up Moonflower and make Lunar's Oil. Rubrum, can you go to the prickly vines and wait for us there? 
We'll come as soon as the moon oil is ready. This is so loud, isn't it? Is it so loud? Okay, that's better. Oh, okay. I'll be waiting in front of the vines. Bye, Rub Rum. All right, let's go to the dispensary now. I should make learner's oil. It's so loud. Ellie, I hope you haven't forgotten. For learner's oil, you need phoenix feather. There's no way we can find phoenix around here. We have a phoenix feather right here. You told me about it earlier. What? Ellie, that's not a good idea. What is this? I lowered it. Is it lower enough? If we do that, we might not be able to get back on the train. We might not make it to High Lion. A witch is always ready to help, starting with the one who needs it most. That again? You just like it here better. Well, of course. You just don't like the witch's house in High Lion. That's true. Stop being childish. You're going to regret it later. No, Virgil. What I will regret is not doing this right now. I'm sure of it. You have to be smart about this. Oh, there was a... You just plucked it off of the ticket? Great. I have all the ingredients now. You're worse than Arya sometimes. A different Arya? Oh, please. That's her mom. I'm nowhere near as good as my mother. That wasn't a compliment. All right, now let's make Lunar's Oil. I mean... Okay. Phoenix Feather Powder, Moonflower Water. Which... We just need one of each. Okay. Oh wait, bird flower. That's not the thing I'm trying to make. Also, there it is, moon flower water. Okay. Stage one, don't stir. Oh, I did both by accident. That's probably fine. Um, stage one, don't stir. Let's go get rid of the prickly vine. I'm here now. Let's hurry up and get rid of those annoying vines. Um, huh? Did you happen to suffer somehow because of me? Don't worry about that. This was my choice, what I really wanted to do. And this is my choice. <gasps> Woo! I guess the moonlight just doesn't reach over here or something. See, Darian, thank you for subbing. Thanks, Ellie. It's no big deal. You can come to the witch's house anytime you want. Are you going to stay there? Yeah, I think I'll keep staying here as an apprentice. Really, really? Really. Keep up the good work, Rub Rum. Keep up the good work too, Ellie. I'm just skipping. They talk too much. <laughs> Quit acting like a saint. This place seems fun to you. That's all. Virgil, try not to say stuff that makes me sound like a bad guy, will you? It's a happy ending for all. If I have fun and they're happy, isn't it? Will the teachers get angry? Like mother, like daughter, that's what they'll say. Well, that's great. I already told you it's not a compliment. Let's head to the village now. I mean, it's midnight, or like nearly... Ooh, I finally arrived at the village. What kind of village would it be? I hope a lot of fun things happen here. There would be a lot of annoying things to take care of. I was always expecting something like that. Let's hurry up and go. Oh, I could pick the weeds. What our new thing open up? I haven't logged anything new. Um, begin apprenticeship. Oh, should I have done that with the moonflower? Should I go back there? Explore the village. Uh, it's quite a dull sight. Virgil, how's the village that you have to stay in for three years? Do you feel like going back to Highline again? What the heck happened here? What's this evilly prickle vine? Evilly, why do I say evilly prickle? I'm so excited, I don't even know where to start. Something seems strange. It feels like I've been here before for some reason. That's her own house, isn't it? Where'd the cat go also? She doesn't remember the ancient language for some reason. Interesting. They don't come this far for a witch's school picnic. Something seems familiar. Let's find Rub Rum.
closed. A restaurant in a village like this? Can you do business in a place like this? Well, that's just a little bit rude. Of course you can. <gasps> Arden's bag. Okay, we're gonna try and find Arden. <gasps> oh, Ellie, thanks for helping me get home. That's nothing special, but it really looks like no one is in the village. Yes, many of them left after the prickly vines have grown. Now we only have Uncle Arden's in my house. I see, you must be bored. No, it's okay, because Grandma and Uncle Arden are here. There are a lot of fun things in the forest. Oh, Grandma wants to meet you. Grandma? Yes, she's the village chief. Chef. Chief? Chief. <laughs> they say not... Oh, wait. I don't know what she just said. Okay, I'll go. Whoa. Are you a ram? <gasps> Whoa. Welcome, witch. You've done a great job with helping my grandchild. Thank you. No, I'm the one who received help. You can speak comfortably. I'm Ellie. I'm an apprentice witch. Many witches look different from their age. All right, I shall speak comfortably, Ellie. Welcome to Wisteria. I'm Enite, chief of this village. Even though both the village chief and the village are in bad shape. What happened in this village? What are all those prickly vines? Did you take a look around the village? Yes, I saw houses covered with prickly vines. They didn't look like ordinary prickly vines. One day, three years ago, those prickly vines started to grow all of a sudden and destroyed the houses one by one. There were already prickly vines growing in the village. The white prickly vine at the village entrance was the one originally growing in the village. But I only saw the prickly vines that started growing for the first time three years ago. At first, they were saying things like God's punishment, monster, or witch's curse. Wipe off your drool, Ellie. It's a serious story. There were lots of rumors, but no one actually knew why. They started growing all of a sudden without an explanation. What happened to the villagers? Nobody was hurt. The prickly vines grew fast for a plant, but not fast enough to hurt anyone. Even so, people who had no place to live anymore left the village inevitably. Now only Arden and I are left to protect the village. Don't worry, I'll help you. I'll remove those prickly vines and bring the villagers back together. Thank you so much for saying that. But it's too late now. What? All the houses have been ruined already and everyone left. It's not a village, but two old people with a lot of regrets are protecting the ruins. Ellie, you should also leave now. It's better to go to the place you were originally planning to go. But I'm not forcing you. You can stay in the village for as long as you want. But leave when the train comes. This place is not a village anymore. That can't happen. Highline is boring. Virgil, bad word. Ellie, there are no more people here. Even if the prickly vines are removed, nothing remains. This is still a village. Even the people who had left would want to come back. Even if the prickly vines disappear, why would they come back to a village like this? Everyone would want to come back. But Ellie, people left and time has passed. I don't think those driven out by the prickly vines will ever want to come back to these ruins. They would definitely want to come back. I wonder if... It's a wonderful village that you have been cultivating all your life, Enite. I can't help... I can't let the village get taken away by those weird prickly vines. Let's go to sleep. Okay. Okay. So I have to go now. Okay, well... What's this? Cannot go in. There's a waterfall. Any new plants? No. Alright, let's go back home because she told us to go to bed. Oh, is this the... The ruin? Why can't I go over here? Okay, well, that looks like the ruin she's protecting. Oh! <gasps> Excuse me? What are you trying to do? Ina is right. It requires a lot of imagination to call this place a village. It's still a village, even if there are no houses. Yeah, but it's not a village if there are no people. The people will come back. How can you be so sure? This is your first time in this village. You've, you're just being ridiculous. No, I definitely heard it. The villagers want to come back. Where did you hear it? You didn't even see a villager. I don't know. Maybe I heard it in a dream. That's absurd. Nope. It's absurd. No, it isn't. Other people would have also wanted... Also have loved the village as much as Enite. I can tell... I can tell even if we met for the first time, there was some kind of throbbing feeling. Who would fix the house if the prickly vines were removed? Oops. There are two old people and one child remaining. 
You're right, Virgil. Correct. You need a carpenter to fix the house. The first person returning has to be a carpenter. I'm just skipping a little bit because they talk so much. I guess you should have a deep dream in order to meet that kind of carpenter. Stop being sarcastic. Hey, maybe I will. It's interesting that they started glowing. Mm, hold on. Is there anything else that I should explore? Oh, that was the way in. Okay. Back to... It's not this way, right? I always go the wrong way. Oh, it is this way. Let's save. And we sleep. She's having a dream, but we're not gonna remember it probably. Did you meet the flying carpenter? I don't know, it seems like I did have a dream, but I don't remember anything. Are you nervous or something since this is your first day as an apprentice witch? Of course not. So are you ready to start your first day as an apprentice witch? Of course. Do you know what to do? Let me ask what Enid thinks first. Although she will naturally approve, it will start from the moment she approves. We'll check out the carpenter's house and try to get rid of the prickly vines. Remember that we don't have any phoenix feather left. It will work out somehow. Let's go to Enite first. Ask Enite if she's made up her mind. Yeah, let's go, um, let's go talk to, oh, uh. Diane? Oh, I love her. She has her little fang tooth. Hello, this is the witch's catalog that gives you the most inexpensive products at best prices. This is Diane Greenwind who brings happiness. Happiness, nice to meet you. Yes, hello, I'm Ellie, an apprentice witch. Oh, I love her. <gasps> yes, nice to meet you, Ellie. What I must help you with today is, oh, you're registering for the first time. Yes, that's right. It must have been an inconvenient for you to not be able to use the witch's catalog. Just a minute. Okay, thank you for waiting. <laughs> so, why are these dialogue lines? I can just skip it. Some of them don't feel like there's a need for them. So I need to see the Master Witch before registering. Is she inside? M the Master Witch? Yes, I need the Master Witch's signature to register in the Witch's catalog. Oh, that's, um, um... Hey, Ellie. Eh, what? Fooling around while I'm out? You didn't forget to register with them. Uh-huh. Oh, no, I didn't forget. Of course not. Oh, I guess the match Master Witch is at some place now. Are you talking through that hat? Yes! Stay quiet, Ellie. You unfinished dumb hat of a little rascal. Why can't you even do one thing properly? I told you to tell me when the Witch's Catalog employee comes. I'm sorry, I was just about to tell you. Oh, sure, then I guess Ellie can just sign instead because the match Master Witch is here. You also received a gift if you join now. Well, a gift? What is it? A witch's broom! A witch's broom, finally! You can just sign here and here. Okay, just a minute. That's it. Then I'll explain how to use the witch's catalog. Would you like to hear it? Yes, please. Every morning, a witch's catalog employee will come. In this case, it will be me. I'm planning to be here from 8 a.m. to 6 p.m. You can just purchase the items you need from me during that time. We do not accept gold coins and only accept luna coins. What is that thing called a luna coin? Luna coin is the currency in witch society. It is called Luna coin because it is made of an ore with the power of the moon. Don't you know already that? Don't you know already that? Oh my god, it's been three minutes already? I'm gonna let it sit for a little longer. Uh, since you were raised in a witch society, Ellie? I think I learned it in school. It's just something I don't think I called money. It's just that I don't think I called money something else in my life. After all, only Luna coins are used in the witch society. But how do I earn Luna Coins? Our girl is missing some vital information about everything. I guess you don't have enough Luna Coins. What? Basically, yes. The Witch Administration is running a service to purchase potions to prepare for such incident. Please let us know at any time since we purchase regu regardless of the type. 
You can sell potions to the merchants. Merchants carry different items and currencies. You can sell using the shop keyword and dialogue. Okay, we need to find merchants though. All right, got it. And there's also the special potion delivery service. And every day of the week, we buy potions at a higher price. You can select one out of three in the list provided and deliver within two days. But since we're buying at a higher price, oh, I can sell to her. That's great. Okay, she's a merchant and so is the other lady. Look at her fit. This is amazing. Wow. So do you have any more questions? No, not anymore. All right, then feel free to talk to me if you need anything. The gift? Right, I'll give it to you now. I got a broom. It's old, but still useful. Finally, my own broom. Control to ride and get off and space to boost. Have a nice day. Okay. I am good at acting. See, this whole conversation is just the witch who was originally here. Could also be someone with malice. Oh, I skipped maybe an important thing if I was going too fast. Oh. Let's ask the villagers later on. Let's deliver potions with the broom for now. You need to get to Enite. Oh, you're right. Apprenticeship. The potion delivery quest is an apprenticeship that you choose to do as needed. If you opt to refuse such apprenticeships, you can use the keyword to do it later. I want to do it. Diane? Diane! Uh, did something happen? I'm sure it was okay to tell you since we just met. What is it? Maybe I can help. Do you remember the potion purchase service? Yeah. Recently there have been several reports of bad potions. Trust in the witch's catalog's potion quality. Trust in the administration. As a result, the administration issued a notice to each catalog salesperson to test the suspicious potions. The problem is the witch's houses I'm in charge of are related to the sp suspicious potions. As you know, Ellie, potion quality is also a matter of wi a witch's confidence. You can't do it yourself, Diane? I need a witch to accompany me with the test for certification. Certification? I can't read right. <laughs> I'm reading things wrong, that's okay. <laughs> Diane trying to put Ellie in witch debt. <laughs> Darn capitalism. If it's all right, may I ask for your help? It's a small reward, but I made some nebula, nebicula, nebicula cupcakes. My mom would always buy me one for on a weekend if I've been good for the week. So naturally, I've hardly had any so far. All right, I'll help. Okay, nutrition potion. And would I test it? A bird cage? To start testing as soon as possible. I also caught a sprout bird. You can throw the nutrition potion to the sprout bird. When the results appear, please gather them and take a look. Then I'll record the details like the date, weather, time, wind direction, etc. Also, please let me know if you make a bad throw. You're very serious about this. I already learned how to do this. Whoa. Four new flowers have bloomed. Moderate temperate sure mild wind and low humidity great fortunately the person potions here seem normal we can relax now at least some of at least one of them is normal this is the reward i promised you Ooh. high demand made by the popular witch bakery nebicula even the tacky witch hat decoration can't stop you from savoring its deliciousness i requested this as a test this time but using potions to collect will be more convenient Hmm. There's a lot happening now. There is a saying that the witch's house, which supplies the most potions every year, uses just as much. Tips about using potions can be found in the encyclopedia. Okay. Again, thank you for your help. Have a nice day. Okay, I wasn't done still, though. Oh, can I take these now? Gimme. Sweet. We have to find Arden also. Should I just eat it? No. Wait, am I out of stamina? Is that what I'm seeing right now? Or is it full? <laughs> I have questions. Uh, 
I want to know which ones are like the the good ones to do. Uh, C. Darian, thank you for subscribing. Chris Garado and Plants Person Person Sage, thank you for subscribing. Um, what's this? Better tools. I don't think I know about that. Oh. Oh my god, I don't have any of that. Okay. Well, I guess I can just make some potions. Right? Let's go talk to e -Knight. We'll make potions for money after. Excuse me, everybody. Just a little sack there. Also, just some broken stuff, okay? Let's go see e -Knight and I have Arden's bag. Do-do-do-do-do-do-do. Hello, e -Knight. Did you sleep well? I thought about it yesterday, but I'm still not sure. The villagers. Yeah, you mean they would want to come back, right? I don't know why you're more confident than me when I lived my whole life in this village. Even so, I decided to believe in that happy thought. Really? If you get rid of the prickly vines, I'll try to contact the resident who was living in that house. But if that resident refuses, don't worry because it won't happen. Ellie, you are so nice. Everything will be fine. Do not worry. Yeah, yeah, I guess so. So... Who should we get first? Was there a carpenter in the village by chance? Because I think the first thing we need is a carpenter in order to fix the house. Of course. The house at the upper left. Kyla! Then it would be better to remove the prickly vines from Kyla's house first. Leave it to me. We need Phoenix. Let's look around Kyla's house. Also, though, can I find... Uh, where's Arden? Hi! Tick-tock, tick-tock for a long time. I don't know what... Alright, you're weird. Oh, I'm not allowed upstairs. Or in there. Where's Arden? I can't go in there. Oh? Temple of the Cat God! Cat God! Based on the sign, there should have been a road. The sign is broken and the road is blocked. Maybe the God is angry? No. No. Oh, oops. Well, isn't that sad? Where the heck is Arden, then? I have his things. Could he be around somewhere else? Oh! Oh, this place is open now. Oh! Hey, you're a witch! So... These are... The Fox's... Grandparents. I don't really, uh... Really see a resemblance, but uh, okay. I'm gonna open my cup of noodle. It should be completed now. Oh, star, being a sweet little bean. Your noodles might overcook. I don't think that's even possible. Um, when they're just sitting in a cup of hot water, because the water is not hot anymore. Do, do, do. Actually, they're pretty hot. They're, they're pretty hot. I'll let that cool off. Okay. Hello, I'm Arden. A dragon and a cook. Did you help Rub Rum? You're pretty kind. Don't mention it. Are you going to stay here? I think I'll end up doing so. Why are you staring at me like that? I'm sorry, it's my first time seeing a dragon with my own eyes. Normally, you wouldn't see one. 
Even Mom said that she seldom met a dragon. That's why I wasn't sure, but you're a real dragon. I never thought I would be meet a chef dragon in a place like this. Since dragons have no reason to mingle with humans, I think I was like that too. I can't tell you the reason if even if you look at me with those eyes, because I don't remember now. It's kind of weird to call it a reward, but tell me if you're hungry. Although it's usually not a reward for what? I'm so confused. Okay, sure. This is for, oh, for rub rum. Take it since it's free. <gasps> Beef bread. Thank you. Hey, did you promise to get rid of those prickly vines? Yeah, but will you be able to do it? Of course. That's some confidence. Okay. Um, I have your bag, dude. I had a dream. What kind of dream? I don't remember. Why did you tell me? Because I remembered that I don't remember. Okay. I'm a dragon, right. I'm also a cook. Can I not? This man doesn't remember anything. Promise that you forgot. Okay. Um. I have your bag. I have your. Ooh. I guess I can't give it to him right now, uh, which is weird, but okay, fine, sure. Let's get out of here. Let's go investigate. This must be the top left, right? Or is there a topper left or one? When did you get out here? Oh wait, it is this one, isn't it? But there isn't anything to investigate. Oh, this must be the house of the person named Kyla. It's in the same condition as the other houses. If you don't get rid of the prickly vines, there's no point in rebuilding the house. Now that we know the location, let's ask other villagers. Who? 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 What other villagers? Enite and Arden. Let's go talk to Arden again. Well, Enite's right here. Prickly vines. When it first appeared, I tried very hard to get rid of it. I tried an axe and also set it on fire and it was useless. Don't we already know how to get rid of it though? Or are they not the same kind? No matter how I made the scar, it healed quickly. That resembles the white prickly vine. Isn't that right? But the white prickly vine disappeared completely when there was a full moon. And these vines didn't disappear even when there was a full moon. It's as strong as the white prickly vine, but doesn't disappear in the moonlight. We thought so too. I mean, it is the providence of nature, so... <gasps> that if there are strong places, there are also weak places. This is all I know. I'm sorry I couldn't be of much help. Okay. Let's go ask Arden about the prickly vines now that we have a keyword. Also, is there anything I can, like... Okay. The prickly vines of the village? Well, I don't know much about the prickly vine. Just I feel the malice filled in it. Malice. The prickly vines that only destroys houses? It's so unnatural. If it's not someone's malice, what would it be? Is there some th someone who would do such ter a terrible thing? I don't know. Well, I'm not sure. I don't know anything. How about searching through the witch's house at least? Okay, sure. Oh, and on the way to the witch's house, please do me a favor. I lost my bag. That's the one! All right. All right, we'll go back to the witch's house now. Do 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 See if we get more information at the witch's house. I haven't been able to write any new thing in my journal. Although, you know what? Can I go back up to the big tree? I never wrote down the thing that dropped out of it, and I wonder if I still could. 
just while we got some nice daylight out. This way. This way. They're gone. I didn't get to draw them. Bummer. Okay, back to my house. Do 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 do. Wrong way. I don't like these little people statues that aren't moving. I feel like they're gonna end up being people later. Oh, and I can make potions to sell. Oh, is this storage now? Does that mean there's no more books in there? Let me save. Let me save and I eat a scoop of noodle. Actually, I set a scoop of noodle out to cool off outside of the cup. Um, okay, I'm assuming we'll need to go to the work workplace. Let's make maybe, um, let's make some weed terminator potions. It's just squishy chub and witch flower. So let's go up and get some, some fur. Because that seems to be like the only one that I can think of to sell. And those are like really easy to get the fur of. Okay, those ones ran away. That's fine because there's more. Four. Do you think I can find two more of those guys? Surely, yeah. Let's make three of those potions. And I think, do I need more of the flower? Oh, my inventory's full. Shoot. All right, we go back. Do, do, do. <gasps> my noodles! I should have not placed my fork very precariously on the edge of the cup to cool off a scoop of noodle because I flicked the fork and the noodle has gone flying. This could have been much worse though. This was actually okay. This is fine. This is okay. But the scoop of noodle is cool now. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. I always can go back here. Oh, I want to use the witch's broom. We need more of the, that flower. <gasps> okay, that's pretty fun. Except running's kind of faster a little bit. Unless I boost. Oops. Oh, it's getting dark. How many did I have in the house? Oh wait, did I grab them? I think it was four, wasn't it? Did anyone pay attention? I think it was four. 
I think that's all I needed was two. Or was it only two in the house? It was four? Okay, good. I want to sell this. She leaves us six. Why didn't I take them? Yeah. Okay. This three times. And don't stir a stage four fire. Now we go sell them. I love that little cloud. One day I want to see what happens when you do it wrong. That day is not today. I also don't want to waste my ingredients. Mm -hmm. Okay. We gotta move. She's leaving in an hour and a half. Okay, so what do we need? Talk to the villagers about the prickly vines. I guess, can I talk to her about them? Oh. Okay, I guess just the little, the little dude is the only one left to talk to about it. There's no other, I don't know where that person went. They just disappeared. Where's the little guy at? He was playing up here before. Oh, wait, where was he playing? He's not in here anymore. There you are. The prickly vine in the village is not so good. Not so good? It's bitter, spicy, and not tasty. It also smells fishy. You ate it? Yes, I drank it by drawing it as tea. I tried, I dried and roasted by picking only thorns, and it was hard. I guess you drink everything as tea. There are so many delicious tea ingredients in the forest. I like apple bush because it's sweet. Grandma says the bird flower tea smells good. I'll also make some delicious tea for you, Ellie. Okay, I'll look forward to it, even though I don't like tea. It tasted similar to that thing. It also tasted similar to white prickly vine and little honey pumpkin in the forest. I guess you also tried drinking all of them? White prickly vine has a good scent. Hmm, if it tastes similar, can you see it as a similar breed? Thanks anyway, it was helpful. Enite ha said it has similar characteristics as white prickly vine. Rub Rum said it tastes like little honey pumpkin, then it's probably also similar to the little honey pumpkin. Arden didn't tell me anything in particular. He said it was someone's malice. Seeing a prickly vine that can destroy and get rid of a house is enough to make you think so. It seems that Arden thinks it's a witch's work. Witch's curse? In a world like today? That's an old fact. We just found someone that was cursed. Did you forget? Let's find the culprit later. Let's think about Kyla's house first. We need to go look through the witch's house. Oh, I see. Let's go to the bookshelf. Do, 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 do. Well, I guess I didn't need to be holding the thing that whole time because it didn't matter. <laughs> Excuse me. See, this is what I tried to do before. Look 
Let me get to some more noodles. When is Empire Season 2 coming out? Well, I'm certainly not going to be reviewing that. Ira Yina, thank you for the Prime. I don't know if I said that right, but thank you for subscribing. Mm. Okay. You can find a book related to the prickly vine. We can try to find a book related to the prickly vine. Oops. Mm. That is hot. I can't read anymore. I can't finish reading this here. Why not? Finish reading it. Who would get rid of the prickly vines if I die? Please don't die just because they read a book for a... People don't die just because they read a book for a long time. I mean, Arya's daughter might die. Look at this book. It looks like there's more than a thousand pages. Anyone would die after reading this. Then you're not going to read anymore? I think I'll throw up if I read one more text. I think the important details come out right after that. What? Really? Where? The first dew of spring, a red moon butterfly, the fourth dawn of a summer. Summarize if you're not going to make it. Mix well and put in the desired plant seeds to make a new plant. It's a method to combine the plant's characteristics. The prickly vines in the village were combined using this method. Oh. From the information I heard, it seems to be a combination of little honey pumpkin and white prickly vine. Why is this book here? Oh. <gasps> Is this witch a bad witch? Is this the bad witch's house? Naturally, that book is not uncommon. It is a book that any witch who is interested in plants would have. Correct. It's merely a possibility. I mean, both of them. For now, this one has the priority. Which one? The part that removes the prickly vines. Let's look through Kyla's house again. Oh, okay. Well, a lot of back and forth. That's fine, though. Do 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 Look at her goofy little face when I run. Okay, so that's this. Look at this. It's definitely shaped like a prickly vine shape and colored like a little honey pumpkin. Well, that means the villagers couldn't get rid of this prickly vine because because you can't get rid of it unless you got get rid of the core, just like the little honey pumpkin. You can get rid of the prickly vine if you get rid of this prickly vine core. Since it's a plant, the prickly vine and the core must be connected in some way. Look over there! The prickly vine is connected to the outside of the village. We can find the core if we follow that. Alright, let's go find the core. How do you intend to get rid of the nucleus? The moon's power should weaken the core since it's the white prickly vine. Is it Luna Oriole again? Where are you going to get a phoenix feather? Well, we have Moonflower, but phoenix feather is the problem. Let's just go buy a train ticket again. I don't have that much money. What do we do? Will Diane sell it? They would sell it for a high price or not carry it. I wonder if there's a potion with the power of the moon among other potions. Speaking of the moon, you picked up a note last time, didn't you? It looked like a recipe. How about decoding it first? Okay, let's decode that. Okay, I understand what we need to do. We need to find the core, which means following, uh-oh. Oh, it's going this way. Diane's already left anyway. This goes in two different directions. This goes this way. We can't go that way. These bits go this way. And this bit goes this way. There's so many all the way up there, but there is no path. There has to be a way to get across. Get closer and take a look. As long as this one is fine, like the one next to it, I think I can cross. It's withered, so find a way to make it grow. If you really don't know, it's okay to ask others. Withered bean sprout. Okay. 
Now we have something to ask everybody. But I think we go to sleep now. Although it is only 6.50. Maybe we can still go back to the village and uh, ask them there. Also, what's up with this split rock? Oh, you know what? Oh, I can't draw it. Shame. It's just something I can't do anything about yet. Okay. I don't know if they'll still be up to um, talking to me at this hour, but we can try. Yes, my love! Yeah. Go back to sleep. Probably gonna be here for like about another two or so hours. So hope everyone's eaten. It's still so hot though. Please stop asking me questions about Lizzie. I'm not her. <laughs> Those are for her. Okay, E night. That's it? Oh. You don't know about the withered? Aw. Well, that's a shame. Now, Arden will not be in the thing. I don't think I'll be able to ask Arden till tomorrow. Yeah, he wouldn't know that. Grandpa, Grandma said that means they're withered. I just asked her about it and she had no idea what I was talking about. Or it didn't grow with a good nutrition. I can't just wait for it to grow. Check the encyclopedia. Also, don't forget about the witch's catalog. All right, we're going to have to go home and sleep. Oh, she's knitting. I was like, what's in, what is she doing? Is he still in here? Oh, he is! Never heard of it. Okay, I didn't think anyone was going to know except the witch. And he doesn't know about that. Okay, well, I had to try. Let's go home and sleep before I pass out. I don't know how it works in this game if you run out of stamina, but let's not let it happen. Yeah, why is Red Rum the only one who knows? And his information came from his grandmother, which is just kind of funny. Nutrition potion. It's right there. But I don't know how to make that yet. She will have a dream and I will not remember it. I, I don't know what that message was a reference to and I decided to delete it because I'm so confused. <laughs> I don't understand. Very strange. What nonsense is this after a good night's sleep? I had a strange dream. What kind of dream? I don't remember. Suspicious? Suspicious, I think. Hello, Ellie. My goal is to get off work on time. I don't know why you're telling me that. Oh, I didn't bring the thing. Oh my god, hold on, Diane. I'll be right back. Gotta go downstairs. Gotta go get it. Is there anything in here? No. Okay, good. I haven't needed... I don't know if I need to eat those or save them for later. I haven't needed to eat too much. 
do do do. Can you read what's written on this note? A note? Shall I take a look? Hmm, this is an ancient witch language. Can you read it? I remember learning it when I was attending school. So you're not the only one who fell asleep in class. What does it say? Hmm, moons? Moons? I can only read up to this. What? I forgot everything because it's been a while since I've learned it and I haven't used it either. Oh. That's because Diane graduated a long time ago. What's your excuse? It hasn't been that long ago since I graduated. Then is there any way to decode the ancient witch language? Of course there's a way. Really? Ancient witch language is definitely a subject you learn in school. So there are also must be knowledge on the ancient witch language in Ellie's head. In short, it does not matter if... It does not matter... Ma it's not a matter of knowledge, but a matter of intelligence that it brings out. That hurt a little. Truth hurts. That's why I recommend the enhanced intel intellect potion. Raises your level of intelligence. Okay. How much does it cost? Don't worry, because there's no problem at all if you use it once or twice in a while. Since I have the recipe registered in the witch's catalog, you can buy one if you need it. Okay, I will do that after I ask. Okay, she doesn't know about that. The witch's catalog. Nutrition potion. Which I might need. That's ten coins. Enhanced intellect is also 10 coins. And a bug net is three? And a witch's white chalk is 25. Okay. Oops. Shift. Wait, hello? I don't know what the shift button was for, but... Let's get some materials together, I think. Oops. Got a bush bug. What kind of ingredients do I need for? So we don't know. Well, let's make a bunch of weed terminator potions. You know what? That's forget all this other stuff I'm messing around with. Um, because those are the ones. Oops, that I can sell. You run away. What other potion can I make? This one has too many. It also takes extract. This one, I really only can make that potion. And I don't know if I can sell candies. So let's just make a bunch of weed exterminator and sell them. Okay, how many is that? I'll only be able to make so much money every day. That's seven furs. But there's like only so many of those little bunny men. Can I go this way? No. I need to get that chalk too one day. I think this goes to the very bottom. Any more bunnies over here? Yeah. I wonder if they come back out eventually, actually. Oh, and I need to be grabbing these, which I haven't been paying attention to finding. All right, we've plucked all of the bunnies we can get our hands on. Let's go find more things.
as many as we can pluck. And then we'll just sell as many of the ones as we can get our hands on. There aren't too many of them around. We're gonna give that guy a nutrition. We're gonna fix that bridge with the chalk one day. I don't think um, there's anything there. The maple herbs are good to get. Okay. We also have other things we can do. I don't think the nutrition one is the one I go for first. I think the enhanced intellect, because I feel like that's what we need to go towards instead. Although I'm pretty sure the nutrition one's gonna be how we fix the other thing. Oh. Maybe the pink flower up there? There is no pink flower up there anymore. Maybe at nighttime we can grab more, but we won't be able to do anything with it. We do have the ability of jotting it down though, which I haven't done yet still, if I even can. All right, I think I grabbed all the ones I could come across. Curse lifting candy. I can deliver by tomorrow. Two curse lifting candy. I'm gonna be rolling in money. I'm gonna be rolling in money. But very quickly, first I'm gonna make all these. You, I'm not making anything. Okay, hold on. Well, no, maybe I should focus on lifting. Oh yeah, we need maple herb extract and squishy fur extract, and I need to make two. Let's just, let's just do that. Oh, I need more maple herb. All right, let's go run and grab that first then. There must be more. More maple herb, more maple herb. It only grows on those vines, so we have to go up to where the viney bits are. So I think one herb is one, no, it is two herb for one extract. So I need two more maple herb. Oh. But there aren't that many walls for climbing on that I can get it from. I can't reach those at all. I have to get across here. And I only have till tomorrow. Oh, there's one there, and I think there's one here. There's two here, good. Oh, let's go to the other side. Okay, back to the house with haste. I didn't pass any. There are other things that grow on those vines, but they're a different thing. 
Okay, we have a lot of things to make. First, the candies. I'm gonna turn everything into extract. Give me one second, and just so that we don't waste uh, in-game time. Hold on. Thank you for your patience. Okay. We have so many extracts. That's the last one of those. I was wondering how you do the specified items that she would buy. I didn't know also that she would just buy candy because it said potions. <gasps> go, 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 go. We're gonna only make two of these. That'll make our two candies. Oh, wait. Stage three, don't stir. I like the potion brewing. It's such a cool way of doing it. And then... Stage four, don't stir. I'll be able to make two. My girl is exhausted. Okay, she leaves a six. Let's go. <laughs> we have so much money. Upgrade your work tools with Luna coins you've earned? Okay, cool, but. <laughs> and an extra four coins. Okay. Okay, there's a, lo I, there's a lot happening here. I have 49 coins. We need the enhanced intelligence, right? I also really want the chalk one. Oh. And then I can still afford a nutrition potion, which is just me having a hunch. I'm nearly out of money now. I don't think I can do another special delivery. Oops. No, I have to wait till tomorrow. Okay, but. Dried pumpkin terrier fur and bird flower water. Dried pumpkin terrier fur is 
four pumpkin terrier fur, which I need to go get a bunch of then. You? Wait, oh, he dropped it, there it is. I don't know how much I have at my house, but I'll just grab four now. And this. And now that I have a net, I can get these guys once it hits actual nighttime. Oh, that must be the same one that's running away from me already. Let's go find a different one. All right, I have at least one back at the house. That's good enough. Running a little bit low on stamina, but I'm not ready to go to bed just yet. Probably just two? It's four. Okay. Four of those. Uh oh. Oh, it's just a reg regular. Wait. Four fur, dried pumpkin. <gasps> Can I not do that? Can I not dry it? Wait. How do I dry something? Try to remove all the vines wrapped around it if you're curious about its true appearance. I am very curious. Uh-oh, I don't know if I can make, um, drink the enhanced intellect potion, but I don't have, it doesn't work in the extractor. I don't know how to get the dried fur. Winter must thank you for subscribing. What's the other one I made? Um, Nutrition potion, silver starbell pollen, maple herb, and bush bug. Two bush bug, two maple herb, two silver starbell pollen, which I can catch now. I also would like to take, oh wait, that was the wrong way. I want that. <laughs> um, I need one more of each of those. Okay. Oh, she's gone. If I can buy the rest from her, we'll find out. Okay, two of those. I need another bush bug. Which we have to find a shaking bush. Okay. Now we just need one more maple thing. And I wanted to go back up to the tree at night. So this is perfect. Oh, yeah, I'll take these too. I think I'll do the chalk another night for that one spot that we're able to draw it. I don't remember where that is, but we'll, we'll find it. 
Although, no, there are just simply no more um, of the flower. I might have just missed my chance at that, for all I know. Yeah, I can't do that one. Somewhere there was one I could do. Maybe it was here. Yeah. I don't have the right chalk. That one's blue. Then maybe there wasn't anywhere for the white chalk yet. <gasps> I want to catch one. <gasps> Ooh, I don't know what I can do with that, but I have one now. Let's try and catch another one. Usually you need these things in twos. Okay, I missed. Oh. Well. Butterfly? All right, it's getting to be too late. Let's go make the nutrition potion and we'll use it the next day. Two of those, two of those, two of those, and stage three clockwise. Uh, I need to finish my noodles before they're cold. All right, let's sleep. I think we've done all we can today. We will have our dream. Mmm, -hmm. the cat. Dude, we'll have another Minecraft stream, just not today. is sleeping so soundly. Mm. Drea, thank you for gifting a sub. Thank you guys all for hanging out while I play through this game. It is so cute. Cheers. Cup of noodle successfully eaten. Okay. Dude, I want to meet the cat god. I want, there's so many, and there's only one chapter out of this game so far. So that's why in about like two hours we'll be all done. Uh, because there's only the one. All right. Oh, I'm killing time by accident. Okay. Lady. First shop. No, there's nothing here to get the handle for the thing. What are these? Two healing candy. Okay. Yes. Two healing candy. Healing candy is witch flower and maple herb. All right, let me put some things away. There will not be a video of it. Oh, my. there will be a VOD video of it. 
Also, I'm gonna put out the unpacking VOD tomorrow on my VOD channel, I think. I mean, at least I'm gonna try. I've been having uploads regularly there again, which I keep trying to do. Okay. So I need two more of these. Actually, no, I don't. I just need four maple. Okay. My VOD channel is called um, Shovel Life. You can find it that way. It's Paul. Thank you for subscribing with your Prime. Okay. We have a lot of things we'd like to do. I need four maple things. And I need to go try and throw this potion. Well, there's a maple thing. Let's grab him. And I'll take those. I meant to put that away. That's fine. <laughs> Let's throw this potion. Um, there's also that vine over there, but I think I have to throw it. I'm not really sure. I, uh, we don't want to do that just yet. We're going to do that one. This also might not even work. Can you? There we go. We need four of those. Um... I'm genius. Okay, before we do that though, because it's not going anywhere. Let's grab these that we need real quick. Just one more. I can totally get over there and heal that thing too. What is the nutrition potion? I'll have to get more of that because I think I can use it on that vine. Although that doesn't seem as important because I can still get over there. Okay, we got our maple leaves. Let's go across the thing. Was I able to go over here before? I'm just going to grab more of these since we're here. Okay, yeah, I think those vines will lead up later. I don't know how to heal those yet. It might not be a nutrition potion. Yay! Although we have a way over here already, so I don't really... I guess that's just a faster way over? <gasps> oh. Can we get rid of this next? This bridge is also broken. Okay, good. I have room in my inventory. <gasps> Whoa. Okay, let's go in the tunnel. Simply cannot see. Simply cannot see. There must be something we can do with that later. Oh. No one has had anything to say to me yet. Okay, I can't take this anywhere. All right. And I can't go in there. Oh, oh. Blue bubble lizard. Leaves their pond to bask in the sunlight on sunny days. Their dull face and tendency to drool makes them quite popular. They love getting their belly rubbed. The hard bubble they release when they feel happy is used as an ingredient. How do I do it? 
his belly. Oh, I have to hold. And bubble from him. There's so much happening. What's this? Wetland grass. I can grab it with my hand also? Itching is picking them barehanded. Wear gloves. Okay, those guys are gone. This place is neat. There's an annoying bird somewhere. And these guys keep going. We're looking for the core. Mm, do I need more of those? Oh yeah, I did actually. Now I'm down there. So... <gasps> okay, I have the witch's chalk. Right? Tell me I have it. Shoot. Oh wait, I do! I know where this is too. All right, we might want to head back soon because I want to make the healing candies and get our money because we can get another chalk. We'll go back and find the nucleus after. Wait, wrong, wrong way, correct way. Correct way. Woohoo! Okay. So. I don't know what the mud is for. And I only need. Okay. Make one more of these. And two of these. Stage four clockwise. Haven't had a counterclockwise one yet. Oops. Okay, there's our healing candies. Let's sell that and buy another chalk. Because I think I like just having one. And that's 30 coins. Honestly, making the other potions to sell is not worth it. Oh, wait, no, no, no. Okay. So we're still hoping to get one of those handles, but... Let's go do following the prickly lines, prickly vines, rather. Uh, we just unlocked the other door to get in. Wait, where was that? Was that here? No. Let's just go all the way up again. 
Or was it here? Oh. This is... I can unlock that now. But that's another chalk used. That's okay with me, though. It really doesn't matter, because it's just a shortcut, but... It's helpful. Alright, let's follow the vines. Although, also, I haven't gone over here. Oh, look at that guy. Alright, but... Not what we're here for. It goes all the way down here. He. Did it work? No, it didn't work because he went away. Is there another one? There he is! Prickly vine traces continue to the forest behind him. Okay. can endure that terrible sound. I have been for a while now. There we go. Now we will have... Can I catch him with... I can catch him with a net. That's all I needed to know. Too slow. I'm just way too slow. What should we do? Oh, I can't get too close to him. Oh, I have to... Okay, we can't go that way. We'll have to ask about how to get rid of him. Oh, there's a chalk over there. But I can't get over there. Bummer. All right, it seems like we've explored all of this. And I don't know what's up with this rock. Something one day maybe I will know about. I wanna try and catch one of these frogs. That should have worked. Hold on. They're known for having one single eye. Their hind legs are always ready to escape from predators. They are very cautious, so approaching them without care will leave you with only with awe at the strength of their hind legs. Okay. All right. I scared that one by accident. Okay. With caution. I'm out of here, I'm going home. Mostly because I don't have any food, oh. Oh, is that a thing with chalk? It doesn't say investigate, though, so I can't see what that little sparkly bit's supposed to be. All right, let's go home. I think it's time to sleep. Oh, wrong way. Oh, yeah, let's check the tent, maybe. I don't remember... Let's start walking, because I don't want to use all my stamina up. 
Let's check the tent and see if they've come back at nighttime. Nope. Oh, and I can't do anything that direction. Seems abandoned. Let's go home. I think it's a little too late to ask the others about that stuff. I wonder what day the train comes. Unless they wait till I get to a certain point in the game first, before they make me make my decision. Getting that chalk seems like the best thing to get. Eh. Let's run home. Do, 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 do. Wait. No, I don't want to make any more. Let's wait till tomorrow. Although, they might ask for an ingredient that I won't be able to get right away. So maybe I should get some. Just the ones that I need to wait till nighttime for. And hopefully just like four of each. Two, two. Uh oh. Maybe I'll just go home actually, because I think she's about to pass out. Yep, that's her about to pass out. Let's go to bed. <laughs> it's time to get up. It's morning. Stop sleep talking and wake up. Yikes. What kind of dream is this obnoxious? You're right. What kind of dream was that? Don't remember. We need to ask about the bird. And let's go see what potion for today. How much do I have? I still have nine. What's that? Two healing candy again. Okay. She doesn't know about him. Okay. Two healing potion or healing candies again. Which is literally witch flower and maple herb. Let's go store some things. Um, I need two of each of those. Two more of each of those. Oops. So let's go grab those. And we'll ask everyone in town about the bird. So we can get him out of the way. I'm gonna wanna have food on me from now on. Cause I almost passed out. Oops. Okay, let's do witch flower. I'll grab the extra while I'm here. Maple herb. Which flower? Maple herb. Let's just grab all the maple herb in the area. So 
So a lot of the unlocks are shortcuts, it seems like, too. And if I can get another chalk, I'll use it on that up there, maybe. All right, let's grab this one and go. We're burning daylight. Doot, doot, doot. Doot, doot, doot. We'll make these, sell them, get our money, get another chalk. Unlock that bridge. After we talk to everybody in town. This game is so cute. I also think we're slowly getting to the end of the story. Um, oh, you know what? I already had a... Well, that doesn't matter. Clockwise, stage four. One. Two. How many have I done for... Oh, I already did. Upgrade your work tools through Diane. That's going to cost a lot of money, maybe. Let's deliver our healing candy. Maybe we won't get a chalk this time. Maybe we'll do um, an upgrade, depending how much it costs and how much these candies get me. Thirty coins. Oh, I can't improve it. 100 loon. Oh my gosh, that's too many things. What about the extractor? 70 coins. Yeah, no, we're not going to be doing that for a while. This sounds like when there's more of the game released, there will be more to do. And like, stock up on getting more money. Let's go find out about this bird. Hey. Oh, I wish I had more friends, he said. I don't know what you're talking about. Oh. Sorry, Red Rum. I gotta go. I'm not sure. She doesn't know either. All right, Arden, I hope you know what I need to know about this. You're the only person left. Best to avoid that crazy bird. I really need to get through. Hmm, then have some beef stew in the meantime while I think. Wow, that looks delicious, 30 gold coins. You said you have to go through the Gaga bird, didn't you? I don't have money for stew. He won't tell me unless I get money? Who am I supposed to get money from? Are you kidding? All I have are Luna coins. Oh, what about you? I didn't know she was here. Uh, the village has been really gloomy for the past few years. I'm just getting started. Never give up on this village. By the way, did you happen to bring the thing you promised last time? Of course! Are you talking about the Yukon melon? No, you promised the roaster handle. 
I'm kidding, of course I brought it. But since this guy broke his leg, I don't think I can bring proper products for a while. Oh really, I feel sorry for him. Thank you for your concern, but don't worry, it will get better soon. I can heal him, I have healing candy. Uh, yeah, what is the offer? Hmm. Uh, I want to leave the work to you. What do you think? Naturally, you will also receive proper wages. <gasps> I need money! This is perfect! I think I'll ask for a potion or animal or plant gathering here. How does that sound? Of course, I like it. Naturally, I'll also look at the quality of the products. That's because good things deserve good prices. It means a bad price for bad products. Just like talking- just like the talking hat said. Okay. Yes, put me to work right away, please. Since I'm not a witch, I will only sell the candies that can be used by non-witches. Since I basically buy them all the time, come and buy them anytime. Can you make 10 healing candy in one day? If I need that many potions, I'll tell you one day in advance. Oh my god, thank god. Okay. Deliver after making a promise. That's because trust... Okay, can we get on to what you want me to do? Two healing candy for 150. You got it right now. And she doesn't know anything about the bird. Okay. Let's go. We just make two more. Go, 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 go. I think I even, I got extra stuff. <gasps> I'm glad I got the extra stuff. <gasps> to dig the broom a grave for the... Oh, I broke it. I need a branch and mud. I broke it. <laughs> I literally broke it already. Okay. Well, I have those things. How do I fix it, though? Also. That's perfect. We can make two healing candies right now. And I can get the money to get the stew. Using two different kinds of monies in this place. What kind of like workbench do I need to build? Stage four clockwise. The thing on. Unless it's that guy in the corner. Okay, two healing candy. Oh, room maintenance is standard in school. Okay, branch or mud? I already did that. Oh, I have more, I have more. Cool. It's ore too. Oh wait, so I can use the... Sick. When else am I gonna need a branch? Now it's almost fully repaired. All right, let's get upstairs. Did I also... I got my money from her. Should I save up my money or should I buy... I want to buy another chalk. Oh, there is no more chalk. Oh, well. Maybe I should have used those more sparingly. Okay. Let's go. Running feels better than the broom sometimes, though. Maybe at least just for this, this one time. 
Oh, healing candy. Boom. That is so much money. And I get to do each of those every day. And even if it was a nighttime ingredient, I have till the next day to do it. Eat. It's difficult unless you can't hear at all. Well, you are a witch after all. I thought you would have come up with something before asking me. That's it? Wait, is there such a potion? Oh. I paid 30 gold coins for that. Is there such a potion? Earmuff potion. Let's go learn earmuff potion. I should have thought of that. Did it, could I have just skipped that? <laughs> if I had thought of it myself. Maybe. That's okay though. We're rolling in it. There it is. I have to get one of those frog. Wetland grass water. Blue moon butterfly extract. Those all will come at night. Wetland grass? Let's see. The butterflies will be nighttime. I think, actually. Maybe they're out in the day? I didn't even really pay attention, but we'll go find out. So we got one of those. Um... Wetland grass water? Where do I get wetland grass? Let's go out there and find out. And let's see if we can get our hands on those frogs. Those might be a bit tricky. I can get so many sticks actually. This uses less, um... So we need wetland grass. Here it is. Takes two pulls. And I don't have gloves. So, we only need two. That bird is so annoying. Oh, I need a nutrition potion for this. That silver star bell, maple, and bug extract. Okay. We're going to wait here, though, until the toads show up. And I actually think I'm going to need to drop that. And I'll probably also drop that. All right, we have to wait for these guys. I also need, um, maple, more maple. Cause 
because that's just a free chalk right there. I also need a blue chalk eventually. I still can't do the intelligence potion until... Whatever happened to our item? Our rotisserie chicken handle? <laughs> wait until they start coming out of the water. If you do happen to have any idea, how do I catch these stupid frogs? Okay, there's the butterflies. I also need to catch those, actually. Oh, he was facing the other way? There's no sneaking potion or tiptoeing that I know of. Okay, we got our blue moon. We need two... Oh, I also need to learn how to roast. Oh man, I have a theory. He's too far now. I have a theory. Let's go back to the other side of the pond. Unfortunately, it's by the bird. Oh. Have you drawn it in your notepad? It tells you. It does not, in fact, tell you. I think it's when they're they're doing their little inhale thing. Oh, I just missed him. Ah, oh, this is so close. After to be able to get in front of it is like impossible. They all they come back out, right? <laughs> Did I scare them all away? I do think moving while their eyes are closed is the move. Hopefully there's more now. There are not more. Maybe on the other side? Oh, there's one. See, I can't approach him from the front. I... I can't. Let's go around. How do you do it? Oops. See, I think if they're looking... I just am not getting lucky with these guys. Does anyone know how to actually do it? 
Not like just guesses on how to do it, but just actually how to do it. button I missed. Okay. I think I get it now. Remember when they told me about the shift button? And I just didn't listen at all to what that was about? I know what it's about now. <laughs> it makes so much sense now. Let's go all the way down. Let's go all the way down. I was getting close. <gasps> Oops. I just need two. Easy. <laughs> oh, I'm I just missed that one. I only need two. Let's go home. Did I get everything I need for... Got everything I need for that one. But then also... Bush bug and silver star bell pollen. I don't know if I got all of that. Did I pass out? Oops. <laughs> 